Okay, so last time we left off, the tank was disabled. It's so you said. Uh, you disabled guys disabled in quotation marks. He, he probably turned that, that that's, off. That's... That's... It got hit by, by a landmine, and he tried to... His check was to see if he could fix it. He failed miserably on it, and it's beyond repair. So his character knows. All his character knows. Beyond repair. And uh, Karnoth was injured. Did you heal him off? I still uh, have seven yeah. wounds left, I think. I healed him as much as I can this mission until he takes more damage. Okay. By the way, you guys are about uh, 30 minutes in on oh, the okay. mission. So just give you an idea where you're at. And you guys were heading towards the objective. You guys have the GPS coordinates of where it's at currently, thanks to um, Tesseract's character. And Question, you guys, Thomas, because this is bothering me. Is your portrait a gray knight? Yes, it is. It looks like a gray knight. Yeah. <laughs> you, uh, I like. You're using the very, very wrong chapter here. I, I love gray knights. They're considering well, no one's supposed to know they exist. Well, you well, got you it. See, after we're done with this mission, we will not exist either. So hey, that's why the, that's on my gray now. I'm a GM. I'm secretly guiding where you're supposed to go. Anyways. <laughs> well, you got to think Ooh. that that's just that's just Boko's uh, roll twenty profile pick. That doesn't represent his character necessarily. He doesn't have a character. Yeah. I am everything. I am. I'm. Yeah. I'm essentially effectively a neutral god. Technically, he is the Grey Knights anyway. Yeah, true that's, neutral. Yeah, exactly. It's hard to be true neutral. So I try. I'm sure you guys know. I err on the side of players. Oh, he's popping open a uh, drink. That'd be me. All right. So what are we going to be doing here, guys? Let's go with you, Tesseract. What is your first? You guys just won the battle. Okay, so we won the battle. We know that the vehicle is beyond repair. So, as as aware, yes. given the, well, I want to check one more time just to, just to make absolutely sure that there's nothing we can do to fix this vehicle, get it going well, again. Last time. I'm, I'm gonna look it up, see if your character would have any inclination of even attempting or thinking about it. Yeah, it's fine. Let's see. Uh, negative negative three point nine. Your guy has would have no real inclination to want to look at that thing. Okay, so... As far as he's concerned, it's toast. The vehicle is borked, brothers. So now, what I want to do is, because we have the GPS location of where we need to go, how far away is that? Hey. Do we need to do navigation to figure that out, or... So I could roll for navigation. I guess I'll roll for that too. Mm -hmm. We could all. You guys, you guys are all. You guys are all huddled together, uh, coordinating a plan of attack. Sure. Uh, what's going to be the modifier? Uh, it's just going to be a ten. What's ten? All right. Oh shit! Uh, we should be going uh, the other. Oh wait, no, that's. <laughs> Well, I'm glad no, the apothecary got uh, perfect on that. Right. So they, yeah, the apothecary. Hmm. He deduces you guys are now probably five clicks away from uh, the AO. It's due west. You should be able to make it on foot. <laughs> it will t take you roughly thirty minutes of travel. I believe we should heed the apothecary. Yep. Are there any swarm nearby that we can detect? Uh, go ahead, roll for perception, look around. Modifier? Uh, oh, I guess I didn't need one. <laughs> holy crap. Remember, remember, on awareness rolls, we get a plus 20 because we're superhuman in our suits. Right. Yeah, see, so use awareness. Use awareness yeah, there. Using awareness then. Oh. Good lord, I rolled a 100 for perception. He just, like, his visor turns off. You're like, what? I can't see Jack Dooley shit. 
Uh, everyone else is looking around. They don't see anything. Hold on, where's perception? I can't find it. Oh, you want more awareness? It's uh, one of the basic awareness. skills. Six, there you go. It's the first basic skill. Plus twenty. I have it on trained, apparently. Interesting. Yes. Yep. Everyone has it trained. Okay. I'm the most aware of us all. <laughs> you guys do some searching. You guys don't see anything. You guys are wasting time. You spent about... You uh, asked us to make this check. <laughs> no, I know. You guys, I'm telling you... No, no, listen. You guys assess this is a waste of time. Let's move forward. That's all I'm, I'm just telling you with your thinking at the time. Nothing here. Mm. Yeah, mug. Get all offended. <laughs> I just want to say, like, is there immediate swarms around? You're wasting your time looking for them. Mm. Right, that's your character is mm. like, this is a waste of time. Push ahead. A more of, no, there's no immediate danger. Good, we can go on and press forward. Has anyone approached the tank uh, uh, yep. tech marine was in? But beyond repair, as far as you know. Negative, uh, your characters won't know the role, but his okay. role was really bad, negative 3.9. Okay. So he's like, God, this is beyond my repair skills. It'll take too long, and we need to get mm -hmm. moving. Because last time it exploded. And with a grenade, yes. Oh, with a grenade, oh. Yeah, or landmine. Landmine, you guys didn't look for any more. <laughs> yeah, that's why I'm asking. <laughs> Did anyone else blow? Oh. No. Landmines? I don't remember any landmines happening. Remember it was that. The tank no, was, uh, blew up trying to go around, trying to flank yep. the... Yep. The uh, oh, okay. Landmines, or anti-vehicle mines, so it would be... Okay, you guys are traveling, so I'm gonna get all your characters in here. Uh, uh, let's see... Who am I missing? Let's see, one, two, three... Uh... Oh man, I still don't have a. Oh, no, no, it's not bad. Karnoth, uh, let's see, who else am I missing? Uh, Tech Marine. That should be everyone, right? Appears that way, yep. I see mine. At least. Yeah. Okay. You guys, go ahead, roll for awareness. As you guys are moving west, line of fire. Remember, you're uh, we're adding twenty to it for your space marines. Twenty. Yep. Well, there could be other bonuses that they're just natural for us too. I'm just saying we get a natural twenty bonus. Hmm. Man, we're all aware. Yeah, you're very aware. It's a trap. Yeah. Yeah, but you're gonna be you're gonna see the trap ahead of time before it springs in you guys. I've noticed that uh for half of us our vision is inverted. Oh. Inverted. Inverted. Inverted should not be. Oh, some people look like they're inverted. Um mine is not inverted. Yeah, it just it just looks like uh, we got a, a darker cone in front of us and a very light cone behind us. I think some of us are having because the issue. lights are stacking with each other, so yeah, the more people are in front uh, of the cone. I, I think that's, that's what's works. going on. I think it's just the way dynamic lighting works. Um, Super weird. Right. Okay. Second, second Imagine there's a flashlight, more flashlights are being added to the light and it's getting brighter. Okay. Go ahead, roll for initiative. You guys will see this. That's the. That's the is that one d twenty? One d ten, I think. Or one d ten plus. It was one d ten plus something. Let me agility. Bonus. Agility. agility. That's it. That's it. Oh, I got wow! I got a ten. So everyone got a lot of people got ten. Let's see, you got eight, ten, seven. Uh, it's going to default to players before the bugs on on tiebreakers. Um, 
and then whoever has the highest agility modifier will break it off then. So, so Yomug, would you like to go first or after me? Um, since we're I both rolled first. Uh, oh, all right. Uh, you know, you know yours should be. I'm just gonna light up this uh, one guy. And light up that guy with some bolter fire. Right. So this guy is definitely much bigger than everything else you fought so far, up to this point. So would you see like a warrior? Uh, or just a very know. big termagant. I don't know. Uh, let me see what roll you'd have to roll to try to just determine what it is. Xenos lore. Xenos lore. Yeah. Oh, Xenos lore. Okay. Go ahead. I'm just letting you know. Oh, it's... also the distances and feet. Any modifiers? Oh, damn it. Yeah, I'll fix that here in a second. Any uh, modifier? Uh, go ahead. Give yourself a 20. One degree of success. Yep, it is a warrior. We have bigger bugs, brothers. Light them up. Uh, and then I'm going to I'm going to shoot this guy with a full round uh, ultra action. I but it's purged the alien. I imagine this is cover between us. Yeah. Yep. You guys are in a valley. You guys are uh, coming up, and they're on. That guy's just kind of like above you guys, so it'd be cover for him. So that brown rocks. It's like a cliff, and he's on elevated ground. Is that it? Yes. yes. All right. Yeah. Uh, but is it like partial cover, bigger cover? Uh, partial cover. So, only a 10 cover penalty? Yep. Sweet. Yeah. That's, uh... Three bullets that hit. I nod right. in admiration. Okay. And... So the way tearing works is you roll an additional die for each one of these, and you... Were Get rid of the lowest die value. Okay. Also, because of the uh, one of these is a ten, uh, we get to roll. Or I get to make an extra uh, hit roll, I think, because of the uh, righteous of the fury. All right. I think uh, Dan's character is from the Brotherhood of Nod. I nod. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for that first one, uh, that 10 there is adding to the first one to uh, 19 plus 5. So 24 for the first one. Ooh. Uh, yeah, 20 damage for the second hit, 19 damage for the third hit. And then because I got two 10s out of this, that's two different attack rolls, I get to make an addition to it. Right. Because of uh, Righteous of the Fury. I don't think you can dodge fire, machine gun fire, right? You just face tank that. Dodges for only, or let's see. Oh, Jesus. So that's uh, that's another hit. <clears throat> Which that 10 is gonna replace that one for 18 points of damage. And uh, because that's a 10, that's technically another Righteous Fury <laughs> attack. <laughs> which hits. Which there's another Righteous Fury. I mean, uh... Can we just agree oh, that this bug is probably dead? Maybe. I mean, if this, if we, if I can dodge, I'm going to have him dodge. <laughs> uh, this uh, reminds me of the... Uh, oh, uh, zero degrees of success. But that means oh. I rolled my attribute, which is a success. <laughs> yes. That means that is a success. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Suffering from success. Okay, I finally missed one shot. <laughs> yeah, I see that. Negative three, negative nine. Okay. 
So go ahead, calculate your damage, and then I want to see if I can dodge any of this. Okay, well, hold on, I gotta. I got uh, uh, 1d10s now. That's fine. And then let's see, he has natural armor. Let me go up natural armor real quick. And this happens only because you have Knights of Fury? Uh, everyone has Righteous Fury. Oh. Yeah. It's if you roll a 10 on any of the damage rolls, you get an attempt at another attack. Yeah. It's part of the base <laughs> mechanics of the, of the game. Um, if you're using uh, Hellfire rounds, I think, um, that Righteous Fury procs on a 9 or a 10 instead of just a 10 for the damage rolls. Gotcha. Uh, but tearing, because of the bullet gun, lets you roll an additional d10 and replace the lowest die with it. So... This is going to take a lot for me to remember. Yep. Yeah, yeah, that's why I have the book up right here. I'm just looking up okay. what I could do to prevent any of this damage. Uh, you can make one dodge roll to prevent one of them. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I figured I could at least dodge. So uh, let's see. Does he... So 24. Well, it whatever. Not... What's his armor? So I can just go ahead and do the math for you now. <laughs> uh, let's see. Should we know what his armor is? <clears throat> I mean, we shouldn't, but either that or I give him a number, then he has to do, do math and subtract it for, you know, seven one, different yeah. damage values. I'll tell you. Yeah, exactly. So they're just. Let's see. The warrior. Righteous Fury, page 246. Yeah. Yay. Wrong, let me know, because, you know, I don't want to get it wrong. But <coughs> I'm pretty sure I've read that. That's just how it works, because it's exploding, and you just keep going with it. That's the Reinforced Chitin All-8. That's, that's what it said. Oh, All-8, so it's 8 armor. So 8 armor. All right, so pin 3, so only 3 armor after penetration. So... Uh, 24 minus 3, so 21 damage for the first one. Alright. Um, <clears throat> then 17 damage for the second one. Alright. Then, uh, 16 damage for the third one. I think he's super dead. Um, uh, so then, um, then 15 18. for the fourth one. Well, let's just say he's dead. I'm gonna cut the, he's you obliterate this guy. He is he is eviscerated. He's uh, atomized. Then, one, uh, then another uh, eighteen, and then another eighteen points of damage. Yeah, he's he's super dead. He only well, has forty hit points. They'll have to so pick him up with the squeegee. So describe describe for everyone here, just so they know how you blew this guy up. Just kingdom come. There are warriors, brothers. <laughs> Pull them to bits. And I just unload a clip uh, into him, uh, and he just, into a fine red paste he goes, uh, which is impressive considering it's a warrior. Uh, there, there's just red mist there. There's just a red mist. Was. There is no longer a body. In fact, some of you, if you didn't turn around fast enough, may not have even realized there was a thing there other than just <laughs> this weird red fog. <laughs> I don't think I real. Yeah, I had I had minus three awareness. I was just looking like the other way. My character yeah. was looking a different way too. Yeah, you turn around, and you turn to look, and you just see a. What a are you fog. even shooting at? <laughs> it was there. I promise you. <laughs> right. It's like one of the oh, well. silverfish bugs that you crush it and it just disintegrates into nothing. <laughs> right. Supposedly that's supposed to be a challenge, but apparently not. Anyway, it's a silver. Oh, continue. It's like an android cockroach. No, no, I was just looking at character voice and like. Oh, okay. Voice. Okay. Hey. Silver, silverfish is a uh, vaguely aquatic-looking bug, even though it's not aquatic. I'm assuming he was in range. So, you, what's your range? A hundred. Oh yeah. So. Okay. Sweet. All right. Who's next? Who's up next? I am. Okay. Go. All right, uh, I'm not seeing any bugs in the immediate area, but let me see. I'm probably just going to run forward, and I can go. My run well, is 24. Yeah, you're aware there's an ambush, so that was supposed to be the the basically the guy who comes behind you. But because you guys' awareness was so high, you guys saw that guy 
before they had a chance to do that. So, okay, you, I charge forward blindly. You can, you can deduce the attack is going to be coming from somewhere in this area, brother. The gotta, attack is coming from somewhere in this area. Or an ambush up ahead, but yeah, you're gonna have to be. You need. You guys need to go this way. So. You also, I see, you put, I see you put 47, which is my toughness, but I think this would actually be my wounds. So this would be like 22. Oh, out of. Uh, let me fix it up. Let's see, and let me see who's next. Is that the moves you're going to be making? Yeah. Because I know how to pre-plan. How do you pre-plan? Shift? Uh, you Next you place. hold down the ruler, then you right-click, and you just keep right-clicking until you oh. get to the uh, the area you want. Then you hold down shift, right-click again, and it'll save it. Oh. Until you click again. Technology is fascinating. Yes, I as a tech marine would know that. Interesting. That is pretty cool. Yeah, right. I noticed you guys were doing waypoints last session. Oh, so you you moved. Okay, who's next? I was honestly hoping you guys would fail that weirdness check. I think Never the uh, I think the I bugs think are next. Yeah. So you got it. Uh, the was next. No, All I already did. Flood? Oh, then it's the bugs. All the tens? Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, wait, so all, th all three people went through? Or took their turn? Yeah, all tens. Uh, the, the bugs are the last ten to go, yeah. We have bugs on the loose. And let's see. Pop up, they went. Then Dem Domingo, Tactical Marine, you're up. Uh, Dan will go next. Yeah, it would be my turn. I have. Oh, nine. sorry, uh, nine. Sorry, I didn't see the nine. Dan, nine. go next. So nine, since nine, 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 nine. our Tech Marine charged straight forward, and now he is being well met with an opposition i'm going to leap in since we are in squad mode i presume still we You're are squad still mode. yeah having that plus 10 bonus movement uh from our what is it like was it oath to glory or was it what was it that gave us plus 10 to free movement that our commander did last last session so that will give me enough movement, uh, considering my jump back, to move to this uh, distance, which would be double my movement speed. Okay. And I would like to make a melee attack. Hey, you can see that guy, right? Uh, oh, wait, first I need to make a pilot check. Hold on. Yep. <sighs> and it was minus 10 because of that big ass sword you got. No, minus 10 is for parrying. Or was it only because it was unbalanced? Yeah, it's just for parrying. No. So modifier would be zero. Then? Yeah, but well, I have it trained, so again, does it give me like a plus 10? Or no, it just means you don't take half the value for attacking. Uh, with a, well, I mean for a pilot skill. My pilot skill is trained, so... So that that's just a flat roll. Plus flat whatever bonus is uh, that Thomas may decide to give you. Yeah. So if, that it, was if, it, okay. if it was not trained, you would use half of your attribute for your mm -hmm. stat instead of your full attribute value. Okay, so since it uses agility, so that would be like my agility bonus as a modifier. No. Would it be, I, okay. Nope. I don't know. No? Uh, well, it's no. just using your agility score because it's trained. If it wasn't trained, then it would use half of your ability score as the target number to go for. Uh, all right, so zero, and then minus one. Uh oh, well, so check. Guess... Uh, another check. No, no, hold on. Let's see. Yeah, negative one. 
Uh, you just go prone. As you land there. As I land, all right, I'm just prone there. Yep. I just you kinda, stumble. You, kinda, you stumble, pff, fall, fall on your face a little bit, so. That sound good. <clears throat> I mean, uh, so, uh, how many, what, what kind of actions does that jump take? Does it take a full action there or half action? Uh, since that was a, a run, I presume that would be full. Okay. Yeah. Then yeah, you have to wait the next turn. All right. Uh, next person. I think that'll be me. Yep. I'll use a half, half move. That'll be six, and then use plus ten for that squad. So it'll be sixteen in total. And then slowly move to the cover to the right, and then I take the rest action to sh fire my heavy bolter at. This little critter on the right. So you have a clear line of sight, but there are rocks kind of obscuring, so. That may be true. All right, the little, the little critter, critter in the south. Okay. Done. So that would be it. Yeah, any modifiers? Uh, they're an open, open valley. Uh, let's give you a plus 10. Point four. Go ahead, do your damage. And I can use the. Was that net 10? It would have a green box around it. Also, oh, okay. over, over it, you can see what you actually got, which was a three and a nine. Yep. Gotcha. I'm. Okay. Okay. Then roll got, red. Yeah, he's roll for a heavy it. bolter. Because huh? he's. He's your devastator by default. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I, he's your tactical uh, devastator. Ah, uh, yes. That's all right. Okay, go ahead and roll see where it lands. Roll what? Uh, you're seeing where your hit lands. If you deal 22 points of damage, you can guess see where it lands. Like, what limb does it hit? Actually, all the... Wait a minute, hold on. I'm looking at this guy's stats. His armor... Is all three. I'm gonna say it doesn't matter, so I'm gonna say 22. Minus... Is that gonna be 19? Oh, he's got armor pin of six, so he that three doesn't even matter. Okay, so he just takes the full 22 then. Sweet. All right. I was, say, I was looking. I was just make, double checking my stats on this guy. Uh, yeah, his armor's all three. I don't everywhere, so it doesn't matter where you hit. Actually, if it, if you hit him in the head, that, that deals more damage, if I recall right. You could roll on that chart, but I'm pretty sure you don't roll on that damage chart unless you're doing stuff. Unless it's like you roll his health in damage. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you go roll ahead. On that chart. Okay. I'll just say roll on it to see if you go for a headshot. Uh, what do I need to do to roll? Uh, what's a uh, 1d100? Oh, I thought that just took your degree of success roll. Yeah. But oh, it does? I thought that's what it did, didn't it? Yeah, don't you, aren't you supposed to, like, invert your roll, and that's what it is? Invert the roll. Oh, yeah, God, so, like, got he got a, a 38, so he would have rolled hit oh, okay. 83 on the chart. That's so weird. All right. Oh, is that <laughs> how that works? I thought it was just the straight roll, was it? No, I think you, I think they inverted. I don't know, I'm trying to... Read it here. Left. Can we okay? Can, can we take a moment to appreciate that dude rolled a one on a D one hundred? No, look at it I'm, carefully, I'm... Tobler. What? Look at it carefully. I am. No, he didn't roll a D one hundred. He rolled one D one. There's a space between the D and the one hundred. Oh, okay. Gotcha. It flipped Sorry. a one-dimensional plane on top of itself. Either, either <laughs> way, hit, hit in the leg, it does the same amount of damage. Or, uh, let's see, because the 62 would land in the same spot. Yeah. yeah okay. Okay. Center of mass, him center of mass to the left, the right leg. I mean, either way, he's... All right, uh, let's go to the next guy. Yeah, he's hurting pretty bad. <laughs> Okay, that would be 
Uh, Blood Angel Apothecary is next. You only actually die if you uh, suffer the you died critical damage. Boom. Because if you run out of wounds, then you just start taking critical damage. So, like, you don't die when you drop the zero wounds. You just start taking critical damage. I thought that was only for Space Marines. No, I'm just looking at the standard combat stuff. Hmm. Oh, look. I mean, it's going to be a hassle to track all that. I'm just tracking the health of the bugs. For you guys, I'll do that. I'll save that for like boss fights. You guys are just essentially fighting mobs at this point. Let me double check combat now. Go to that chapter. Okay, you <coughs> lose hands. You just record damage. Okay. The damage goes up. Okay. Yep, Pothcare, you're up. Alrighty. Apothecary here. What page are you on? You know this. Uh, two fifty. Two fifty. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you're five pages ahead. Do, do, do. Hey, and that's what. You're... On to whoever's next. Uh, it would be. Our ten guy. Let's see. So that's the Iron Snake ten. Oh, did the bugs already go? Yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. They they moved. They didn't have you guys line of sight. They already went. Yeah. Cool. Because their range is. Uh, you guys are just now coming into range of them. The the ones that can't shoot. Okay. Well, I'm gonna shoot at that melee guy. Go for it. Ooh. Question, can I react? Can I have reactions when, I, well, when I'm prone or, or not? Uh, I mean, did someone attacking you? Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, within reason, I'll allow it. Yeah, I'll have All to right. look it up, but... For every degree of success, that's a hit, so that's two hits. Go for it. Blast this guy, smithereen, smithers. Okay, oh, no. cool. Well, I'm gonna <laughs> do some crazy shit here. Uh oh, we're doing I'm this sorry, again. Jack, we're we're just gonna stop as soon as you reach over thirty damage. Okay. Uh, well, the first one is fifteen. Okay. And the second one he already is more him. than fifteen. And I'm sure your armor pen... Actually, the second one would be 15. Is so, five, yeah, it's 15 yeah. and 15. So I just did three your... damage with both of those rolls. Okay, and your armor pen's more than than three and all that jazz? Oh, yeah. well, if that's the case... Yeah, I was assuming these were warriors with uh, that armor of eight or whatnot. Oh, well, there's just the one. If these are... Oh, then yeah. Uh, yeah. Splash. He's super dead, then. Yeah, so... Okay, go ahead. go ahead. Describe how you kill this bastard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bolt around to the gut, bolt around to the face, he explodes in the appropriate locations. Amazing. And then, uh, I just go, yes, yes, kill them. Alright, then it would be our tech brain next. Alright, so I would like to, let's see. I would like to use my bolt gun to attack this ranged enemy here. Go for it. I believe he's ranged. All right. Here we go. Yeah, he's a gun. Gonna do two hit roll modifier. Uh, open field. I'm gonna give you a, a ten. My like last guy. All right, all right. And yell yeah, mug. I should give you ten as well, but you definitely. Get all right. So Do more than eight damage, and this guy explodes. I'm gonna hit damage. Death. Yeah, he's right. dead. Okay, go ahead. Just grab how you kill this guy. I fire uh, several bolter shots down range. 
uh, blowing his limbs apart, and I shoot the limbs out of the air, and they explode into pink mist. <laughs> uh, Karnoth, I think you're up. That's it's a, nice term, it's a Bug's turn. First Bug's turn. It's my... Oh, yeah, yeah, Bug, Bug, Bug's turn. Right. I almost got ahead of myself. All right, so this one is going to attack you. So I'm going to hit, and I'm going to get a... Okay. This guy's uh, striking you. He hits you. I'm going to... And they have pen three. I can hit. do a parry as a reaction. Okay. Uh, uh, minus, minus ten. Minus ten. But, yeah, I'll... Uh, minus ten. Let's... All right. Where Earth's can parry? I... Yes, yes, that's a skill. Yeah, it's a, yeah, that's how you do fight and melee. Yeah, parry. And you can also dodge ranged attacks. So if anything shoots at you, you can do a dodge reaction. Yes. Mm -hmm. see find dodge, it? but I don't see parry. It could be parry. It could be... Is there yeah, a re it's, parry. it's a reaction. Test weapon skill to negate a hit. Ah, oh, there it's okay. Reaction test. I don't see it. Uh, it's raw weapon skill, didn't you say? No, it's a... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just weapon skill. Yeah, weapon skill? Okay. Weapon uh, skill. No, it, uh, well, dodge is a basic skill. But I guess parry isn't a basic skill. Yeah, it'd be a weapon skill, right? It said roll, yeah, it says roll uh, weapon skill. So you just uh, roll your weapon skill. Weapons, yeah, weapon skill minus gotcha. 10. Gotcha. But Sweet. Where, where can I see my weapon skill? I think that's one of your basics. Characteristics. It's your characteristics. You'll see weapon skill. It's a button. You click it. Use WS. The, oh, the, just my, oh, oh I, that's my... Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Base, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And just minus 10. And minus 10. That's considering I'm pruned. Right. Yep. Um, yeah, that's why I'm giving you minus 10 there. Well, shit. Oh, no. Yeah, you, you, you attempt to and see how bad was that? Minus yeah. five. You kind of you kind of just toss your weapon a little bit. Uh, I reach now and he hits you pin against the ground and he hits you. Now, remember, you do have fate points. Just going to throw that out there. Mm -hmm. You have three. Do you wish to use it? Uh, I'm pretty sure he's fine. Yeah, I thought, yeah, yeah. I thought we had five. You have three. Three every every session. Yep. Gotcha. Three. Are you going to take the hit or are you going to use a fate point to re roll I'm that? Gonna take, take, I'm going to take the hit. Okay, so it is 15, and you said it's that inverted number, so 34 for 15 damage, and 34 lands on uh, center chest. Center chest for 15 damage, pen three. And so I go ahead. So the, the bottom number is my like number of it that needs to be. Uh, yeah, the, bo the bottom number is the uh, the armor. Yep, yeah. you need your armor and your chest is going to save you. You should uh, have around twenty to twenty-two ish. I think. I, uh, I'm not sure where this. That's correct. Hold on. I'm going to send it to the Death Watch chat. If it's body, you should have about 22 armor. Right, because I mentioned that's how... I thought... Because I, I, I have 35. So that that would negate oh. the entire attack, wouldn't it? Don't no, think those 30s are three. correct at all. Yeah, those don't seem right. Yeah. Because, like... Yeah. What's your uh, characteristics look like? Hold on, let me show you. Oh, it's in... Okay, this death watch chat. Because like I imagine that's like what the uh, power armor does. It's ah. like eight to the limbs. Oh, and you didn't. Uh, I, th I thought we fixed that. I thought we uh, barely not. Please. No. Uh, yeah, yeah. Strength. All those little numbers in all those little boxes should be zero. Right. And the numbers right. in strength and toughness needs to be three. Yep. Strength it's and blank. Okay. And then the other one should be blank. Okay. Yes. Yeah, not zero, but blank. Oh, blank. Okay. Yeah, we don't want you to multiply by zero. 
Alright. No, it, it has a minimum multiplier of one, regardless of what you put in there. Or worse, gotcha. divide by zero. But either, either way, either way, the bug hits you in the, the best spot possible. It just, it's just, your armor absorbs all that damage. That's 22. Except for the three, it, the armor penetration of three would get through. Uh, armor pen three would bring his 22 down to 19, and 19 uh, is... Yeah, but the armor bypasses armor. Huh? No, it just uh, reduces your armor it reduces reduction. Arm. Yeah, so yeah. Because, because... because 15 is still less than what your total armor would have been with the pen, he still doesn't take any damage. Jeez. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it just bounces yeah. off of him? Space, yep. space brain armor. And a... That might be correct. Uh, I'll have to look. Uh, he has 23 on everything, but it seems weird. It still seems a tad high, but... Uh, I mean, toughness and strength need to be three if they're not. I mean, he does have uh, all the other toughness. numbers look correct. So, I find that odd because, at least for me... Keep in mind, his, his toughness bonus would be five times three, so 15 okay. in there. Plus the 10 for the armor, it's right. Okay, yeah, yeah. My question is, I have... Okay, so under armor and defense, is it the top or the bottom number that's your armor? The top one is your uh, your suit's armor. The bottom one is you with all your bonuses. Okay, including the suit? Yes. Okay. Because for me, like... My bottom numbers on everything is 14, except for my body, which is 16. Yeah, okay, you need to add, like, the 8 and 10. That's the armor did, did you add the 8 and the 10 for the armor in? Yeah, so, like, the I've got 10 on what body. What is your toughness? Uh, let's see. Have you have you been modifying it in, like, the health bar on, like, on your token? My toughness is 22. That doesn't seem right. Yeah, that you 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 overrode it with your wounds when you were trying to do it for your token. So like if you oh, write oh. the health for the token, it overrides your toughness. Okay, so this should be forty-seven. So now let me look. Okay, yeah. So I'm twenty on everything now except body. It's just twenty-two. Jeez, we're powerful. Jeez. Oh yeah, I know. Yep. Yes, you are. Extremely powerful. <laughs> I, I like how this swarm is sending like six people at us. I'm Might doing more than I'm, that. I'm literally doing what the thing suggests to do. Um, so I might have the mod. Because no, I mean, we're, we're Death Watch, and standard swarms aren't supposed to really harm us at all. Like yeah. f fires and shots, we're supposed to ignore pretty much anything and everything. Uh, it's the bigger, badder beasts that become the dangers, like that warrior. If he didn't get atomized, um, <laughs> yeah. what if he uh, an actual danger to us with his weapon and and stuff because he has more powerful weapons? But we're fighting Termagants and Hormagants. They are the weakest of the weak. Yep. Yeah. That's why I had you fight a whole swarm of them. I mean, that that they eventually would kill you. If he didn't get atomized. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it'd be like it'd be like fighting. Uh, I mean, so far, the biggest danger to us is ourselves. Yeah, <laughs> true. Yeah, it's a grenade. <laughs> um, so, Termagant, he's going to go, and he's going to shoot at you. Actually, no, you're you're pretty close. He's going to just swat at you again. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, 69. <laughs> he just kind of, like, swats at you, and it just clinks up my armor. Yeah, it clinks and hits the guy next to him. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, decapitating him. Right. <laughs> oh jeez. Yeah, you think we're danger to ourselves? What about these monsters? <laughs> Uh, let's see, and then let's... How did Bao even, like, was it under threat? Like, how? Hey. Like, Cause there's an uh, endless swarm of them. Uh, let's see, this time we're gonna shoot at you, Moth. Or like the grunts. Individually, they're terrible, but in groups, they're powerful. 
Yeah, that's what it feels like. Uh, let's see. That's the way it is in tabletop, too. The armies that have uh, swarms of uh, troops usually do better because you just roll more dice, so you have more chances of hitting and wounding. God. Yes. 76. So, he... yeah, his weapon explodes in his arm. <laughs> Doesn't, doesn't really hurt him. He's, it doesn't feel like he's hurting him. He's like, ah, ah his weapon jammed. All right. You know, I don't think we have to worry about this particular tendril. Uh, it's poorly evolved. Yeah. I think it's, it's just going to kill itself before it does any action yeah. or anything else. All right. So this one's going to come at you. It seems to be. And then let's see who's next. It would be the nine guy, Dan. Uh, well, then, uh, I get up, I guess. Uh, wait, so did, I don't look hang on, uh, so did dude what go? No, no, I, I'm, I'm after Oh, that. you're, you're eight. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. I, but yeah, something yeah, does feel not, off. Did we skip a person? N no, uh, no, we were just talking as we're yeah. playing the monsters. Uh, is there, I wonder, is there an attack opportunity in this game, or is that d and I'm thinking of? Let me double check. Uh, probably just D&D. &D. Okay. Uh, I think the only reaction is dodge and parry? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm just making sure. Alright, so you stand up. I don't think I can attack as a half action. Mm -mm. Because like, I have to get up as a half action. So I guess I'm just staring down this... Dermagont, or is Dermagont? Yeah, with like disgust, and just end my turn. <laughs> oh, yep. Why did so strange? Clicked on the wrong guy, I guess. Is that up? Okay, now it is. Um, Domingo, go. Got this. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Yeah, I'll definitely have to look at the encounters and modify them slightly because they feel a little underwhelming. Or what we, or what this we are. The, this is also the first mission. This yeah, is, this is true. The first mission. This is this, this is true. And I, I'm trying to be in line with what this mission says to do and not kill you. That's why I, I'm just doing the, the starter book and modified it but the players that I modified for aren't here, so I'm still going to make whatever that was supposed to uh, Where is that guy, by the way? Tesseract? Who? The, the guy that was the Merc. Uh, Robopin. Uh, he says that he became really busy, and he's not yeah, going to be able to... Be able. Oh, dead. Okay, so my shotgun approach to player getting worked. Excellent. Well, he's... I think he's going to join, but it's going to be much, much later, like a few sessions in. I mean, uh, he said he, I mean, it's it's unclear, basically. So, we'll see. Um, yep, yeah, I will not kill his character. I'm going to use half action to get to, co uh, to get to cover. And then... Uh, you, you can just use movement, you don't have to use half action. Oh, I thought, oh, okay. Yeah, and if, well, if we're movement still using half, our uh, squad bonus, you can just you have a free movement to go into cover every right. round. Yep. Gotcha. Okay, uh, so I still have like a full action left then. Yeah, yes. that's correct. Then I will. Uh, Sorry, go ahead. Then I will use the uh, bolter with a uh, fire selector. Okay, go for it. I'm guessing that's 20, or is that covering the way? Let's see. You, which one are you shooting? Shooting okay. that. Yeah. Covers in the way. It's, uh, yeah, you're going to full cover, so go ahead. 20 on that shot. 20. Minus 20? Yep. Yeah. Oh, minus 20. Okay. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Full auto, straight roll. Da, 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 da. All right, roll for that. Do your damage. My damage do I have to do again? I, I, 
Every degree of success on full auto is an extra hit up to your uh uh oh. So go also, ahead and describe remember you get to uh oh wonder mind it's, yeah, it's the cheap stuff. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and describe how you kill this guy. Because he... As I moved Dude, into yeah. position as I moved into position using cover as st stable grounds, aiming at his head, firing a shot, fire the bullet rain rains down to this little creature, exploding his head. And he's slowly falling down to the ground. Nice. Badass. Uh, I had a question about the squad uh, disability that you, I think you said that once we enter the squad mode, we need to be within 30 meters of each other for yeah, that. Yeah, and if you leave that 30 meters, you lose the bonus. But if you rejoin squad mode, you get it back. Uh, okay. Granted, to join squad mode, it does take a full action. Um to uh, go back into squad mode, or you can make a check, uh, a, a squad test, uh, which is you just roll a d10, and if you get a 7 or lower, um, because our current cohesion is 7, uh, then you automatically get it. Although I could just on my turn uh, boost our squad cohesion to 10, because that's just what ultramarines do uh, for their squad abilities, uh, which would mean uh, we can freely pop in and out of... Uh, squad mode for free without having to spend an entire round going into squad mode. So every time we go back into uh, within 30 meters, we'll have that that movement bonus. Yep. I mean, either way, he was going to take cover because it's just a short distance. His move, it was like, what, six meters, six, seven meters? So, yeah. I mean, with or without that bonus of his, the free action, you still could do what you did. You're, you're good. Also, maps are horribly not scaled correctly. <laughs> After all, it is essentially five meters from uh, my left shoulder pad to my right shoulder pad, which I do not believe is correct. <laughs> These are tokens. These are token, tokens. Tokens I mean, are not to scale. I mean, you want me to, to to scale it? I guess we can do. Let's see. Uh, yeah, but I'm standing in a uh, five meter, essentially square. Yeah. You know. Yeah, but tokens are not to scale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I, I get that. But I'm saying like yeah, space on standing, but it's still representing our character on a map. Correct. And uh, it's five meter units, so. So who's up? I think I finished my term, so the next one is but, uh, Apocalypse. Death, Death, Death okay. Life operates in like one meter units and not five meter units. I can do that too. I was just trying to make the the map bigger without making yeah. it bigger. So you guys, you guys didn't have to scroll everywhere. So these yeah. are random encounters. These are not points of interest. So yeah, I understand. Just, just keep in mind though that uh, this game functions on the one meter unit. So if you were, you were doing a a, a grid based combat, each each square would be one meter instead of you know five. I'm yeah. I'm just trying to give you guys degrees of movement or freedom to do whatever. Yeah, yeah. So, but yeah, this is a wonderful way of making the map bigger without making it bigger. Yep. As well as playing with the mechanics of the uh, <coughs> say. Right. Okay, uh, who's up next? So Domingo went. That'd be Moth. Moth. Probably me. Mothra. Yep, yep. That's making you feel powerful, though. <laughs> All these guys you've been slaying. Like... I mean, to be fair, we are powerful. We're space marines. Canonically, we're one of the toughest bastards in the galaxy. You yeah, are. Uh, literally. <clears throat> yeah, I kind of want to soften the encounters a little bit, not too much. So I was like, I'll go as hard as they need to be. That is what the book says. That seems to be. Yep. So go ahead, go off. There's a guy in front of you. Yeah. I don't remember the rules on two weapon fighting. On um, what? I do know you're supposed to be able to shoot somebody with a pistol in melee, but I don't remember if you're allowed to do it as a two weapon fighting attack or not. I thought you were a melee character anyway. Yeah. But if I also have a gun, yeah. why not do both? 
the pistol, right? You should be able to just use it. Yeah. Just use it. Because even if there's no rule set in the book, that that doesn't make lore-wise sense. Because they they that's literally what they use it for in melee. Does he get any bonuses to being so close or no? No. Uh, oh, I'll give you ten. You are he is in your face. I'll give you ten. It's in your face. Just don't XCOM this guy and miss. <laughs> I always love XCOM like that. It's like he's like, I have to kill this guy on this turn, or else my whole team's dead. I the fucking miss. A chance to hit. <laughs> Always guaranteed miss. I remember like, due to uh, a rounding error in the original game, even if it says you have a hundred percent chance, you can still miss. Oh, <laughs> wonderful! <laughs> All right, go, Moth. You dead? Ah, okay. Two weapon combat requires a talent to function. There's a right, dexterous and there is, yeah, there's. Yeah, you, you can't make, um, a, say, a chainsword attack and a bolter pistol attack in the same oh, turn. Oh, no. Unless you I didn't. No, I, I. Which is what I was looking at. Oh, okay. No, I was thinking you're using your range as your melee attack. I'm like, yeah, that's fine. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> 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 Fucking 96. Holy shit. Go ahead, roll for your damage anyways. You're going to hit this guy still. Uh, yeah, you're going to hit him, all right. Um, and yourself. Oh, that is the wrong. No, it yeah, but say. <laughs> that sucks. So instead of shooting him, you hit him with the gun, and the rounds <laughs> go off. You rolled for his chainsword. Wait, wait, yeah, you rolled for your oh, chainsword. Oh, chainsword. Oh, okay, chainsword. Uh... Oh man, yeah, you drop that sucker. You drop that sucker. It it buries in that guy and buries in the ground. And it's no longer in your hands there. Oh, and it's just funny. grinding in the ground. <laughs> uh, let's is, see. Is he still alive? Uh, oh god. Herbert, Herbert God is super dead. Um, he's he's decapitated. The servitors oiled that chainsword too well. <laughs> yeah, it's just, it, it's just, it's in the ground, just fucking stuck. Hey, uh, who's next? I believe... Oh, they're all dead. I think uh, everyone's one. one. Oh, there's still one uh, left. Still uh, one. Me. So it's gonna uh, be, uh, Mr. Uh, Iron Mr. Iron Ultra Snake Smurf. Tactical, yeah, next. Go I'm for it. Just gonna be a run of 30 meters. And that's my action. Alright. Alright, I believe I'm up. Yes, you are. So. I would like to. Fire my bolter at this sorry fuck right here. Oh, no. the melee. That's yeah, you know a bad melee idea. Melee, right? There are rules for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. As in, you could hit your friend. I mean, I'm firing my bolter, not throwing a grenade. I could throw a grenade. Yeah. Cold. No, no, no. They're firing into firing into melee. Um, I'm within guys. melee range of that guy. That's why I'm getting get hit. So right, you have a chance Point of blank, hitting uh, me. Ballistic shots are at plus thirty. Who? Plus thirty? Okay, yeah, plus thirty. No, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not in melee with this guy. I know, no, no, I know. No, no. I was just saying for that previously when he was wearing a reference. reference. I, yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah, sorry. Uh, let's see. Point, point play. Okay. Uh, let's see. I, I'm, I'm not the guy right next to it. I'm behind. Yeah. No, no, no. no. So, we were well aware what you're doing. You're firing a right, vulture right. in, into a melee fight. Yes. Da, 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 take you that, you friend. Bullet it's takes melee. A load, right? If one yes. of our characters engaged in melee are stunned, helpless, or unaware this penalty is ignored so it's minus 20. Yep. All right. So That's basically, it. yeah. Minus 20 oh, on my chance hit roll. Yeah. Okay, what page is what page is that? 
Uh, that's uh, 247. Thanks. Okay. Oh Thanks. shit. Thanks. I rolled Thanks. 83. Oh, no. I want you to roll your damage. I want you to roll your full attacks. Whatever. If you have a little uh, extra damage, the extra rolling you guys do, do all of that. Can I reaction roll? A oh, oh shit. No. Nope. Oh, oh no! Yeah. You'd be uh, you'd be unaware of this. You're in melee. You're un yeah. Yeah, oblivious. You're back with... to it. Okay, so what happens if I roll a ten? Do I have to? You get, you get another attack at the same modifiers. <laughs> All right. Um, also, oh, you need to roll a one d ten and see if it's better than a four, because that'll change what damage is actually done. Because it. Oh God. I do have fate points. You wish to re-roll that initially sucky roll. Yes, I will spend a fate point to do that. Because holy All right. crap. Alright, I'm down to two fate uh. points now. So, I'm re-rolling the whole thing now? Yep, I'll allow it. It's like, right. I, I, I'm just letting you know, Karnal, that's the degrees of uh, fuck-up that would have just happened. The bugs are I'm deadly. Aware. It's, it's your friends that would have annihilated you. <laughs> I'm aware. I'm um, very well stated aware. earlier. All right, minus our only danger is ourselves. Keep in mind, he's the wounded party here. Okay, that's so a little bit damage. better. Okay, still roll for damage against them. All right, but you don't need to do the full, all the extra. You can just just do the. Well, uh, I d I don't have to do full anyway. Cause. No, uh, yeah, but I'm saying you don't have to do the, if you get 10, do more, get 10, do well, more. Well, I, I didn't get a get 10, stuff. so that's irrelevant. Yeah, 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 yeah. So he's taking it, what is that, 3, position 3. He's taking a headshot. He's taking a headshot. Shot the back of my head. For that 17 damage. damage. I will still absorb it, all of it. I will absorb all of it. So, yeah, 17. you notice a big cut in the back of your head. Now, hang on. I have five penetration. But it's not five pen. Yes, yes, yes. I will observe all of it. Yes. He's got. What's he's your got armor? armor? Seventeen. You have. Two. It's like twenty. He's got twenty-three head armor. Twenty-three so head armor. just enough oh, to avoid. Oh, just enough to get it. Yeah, because uh -oh. that brings that to eighteen. You definitely feel that. Ka -tung. I you feel like you get punched in the back head of the head. head. Right. Yeah. No, and you I feel very powerful and I punch. Just look at my tech marine in like surprise. I shake my head in disappointment. You nod in disappointment. You you nod because of the impact of the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> it's so yeah, it's so wonderful. Um, all right, who's uh, who's up next? So my question is: Does that glance off and hit the monster in any way, or is it just? No, you, no, mean, you failed. No. Okay. no, you failed. No, right. no. All right, I failed. I know what you're trying to do. Roll, you know. The forward. It is the bug's turn, is it not? Oh, yeah. Uh, bugs. Let me check. Uh, Did all, all the 10s go? <laughs> yep. All two of them, yeah. All two of them. Okay. Okay, so he is a termagant. Will this little critter react to him? To the scene of death marines, uh, doing friendly fire. Yeah, this guy runs away. He's just gonna. <laughs> They're routed. Oh yeah, no! He just, he just kind of like uh, fuck this, and he just runs off. <laughs> That's his action. Uh, let's see. It's next. And then who's next? Dan. Me. All right. Do your uh, thing. I just charge in again. Actually, wait, right. hold on. Hold on. What's what's the thirty-four? Oh yeah. Give you a I plus ten on your pilot check. Yeah. I can I, I, I can run up to him. I don't have to because. Oh I can, okay. Yeah, so I don't have to do the pilot check. I can just run up to him. Go for it. And I'm gonna do a melee attack. I think a run takes full action, doesn't it? Uh, charge lets you uh, get there. Oh, okay, uh, cool. Charge, okay. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like, nope. And hit. Let's say 
normal plus zero, I presume? Mm -hmm. uh, if you charge, you get a plus 10 to your attack, so that's an extra degree of success. Okay. So, 2.9. All right, I re roll then. No, you're no, good. No, 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 2.9. Okay. You got it. All right, Go ahead, so roll your I, damage. I roll twice, then I presume? Or... Yep. All right. Holy <laughs> shit. I think he does. Go, go ahead and describe how he kills guy. Uh, at a pure frustration, I just sprint at this little fuck, and I, uh, I guess I just wind up my chainsword as I'm running, and then I do a full power, just clean, uh, horizontal body. Great. You guys have to try. Yeah, it's just a massive claymore thing, right? Ah, oh, fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that that reminds me of Jack Ripper from Metal Gear. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, you guys are proceeding to west. Let me see if you have any more encounters between here and there. You guys are pretty close. Why is that plus thirty-five damage? That's what I was wondering. Wait, hold on. Am I doing it right? Hold on. No, that modifier is wrong. <laughs> like, if I look at mine... Yeah, it should be 2d10. So what's your relative bonus? Your your combat knife should be doing more damage, too, I think. Uh, no. Oh, I had a, oh, I had an, a zero in there for an accident. Damn. I think do it. Either way, it's I think. Should this should, should this, wait? No, that's a hit. Hold on. Uh, damage. There you go. That should be correct. Oh, 17. Yeah, that's right. Yep. Yeah, that's more like it. Still would have killed him either way. But... Hey. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hey. Go ahead. Uh, you guys are all going for navigation as you guys are making your way towards the final objective point. You guys aren't too far out. Uh, any modifier? Uh, plus 20. Oh. How do you whisper? Uh, slash W. And then character name. You guys, you guys make your way to the crash site. Or, you guys, as you guys are coming up on the crash site. See? Oh. I think I should take this moment and take a quick bathroom break. Yeah, no All problem. Right. Bio uh, break. Talking. How do you guys want to approach the, cr the crash site from the north? From the... Let's see. From the north? Uh, from the northwest west or south? I will stick to my team no matter no matter which direction we take. Yeah, yeah, I'm just curious. Do we want that. to approach it from the direction of which uh, we're coming from? I presume we can do that. Because that would be the most direct approach. Uh, sure. Okay. Um, just... And we won't know, you know, what doors are open where until we get to the wreck anyway. Yeah. Alright, so you're just going to approach the crash site uh, directly from the west. Okay. Well, I think we approached it from the north. But whatever. You you guys are heading east, so you guys oh, become, east. yeah, you'd be on the western edge of the of the site. Uh, I don't have any vision, it's just all black. Okay, give one, yeah, give yeah, me one second. Now. Hold up, some of these tokens are wrong. Uh, let's see. And then. Ah, here we go. Who am I missing? Turn off, right? Yeah. Oh, hold up. Is this not... Yep. Let me get the descriptor for you guys real quick.
The jagged scars that crash shuttle left scorched plank earth is visible long before he came to the broken body of the shuttlecraft itself. The once my machine, the spearheaded shaped Kestrel class interplanetary uh, lighter lance scattered across the rutted bank of uh, earth, uh, rampart by its crash landing. It's back broken and it's hull plating torn apart like paper. Despite the ruin of the wreckage, it appears the ship's reactor and fuel lines did not rupture on impact. Otherwise, there'd be nothing left but a glowing crater. The drawers in the rear armor prow compartment hang open where the emergency explosion bolts have loosened from the occupants to escape. But there's no sign of them or any other life, except for the uh, tyrannies around it. <laughs> nice. All right. Yeah, I modified the initial encounter of this because of how... Now this is a match for our skills. Oh, my yeah. back gonna miss. Uh, you missed uh, us coming up on this crash landing and the reactor and fuel lines are intact, but it's pretty badly torn apart. It's a Kestrel How much class. time? So, don't shoot it. How much time has passed, by the way? Uh, so far in total, uh, 45 minutes in the mission. Didn't take you very much long. You guys were able to make good good time coming from where you're at. So you guys have approximately, um, what, three hours, 15 minutes? Do we know how long extraction will take to get here? Say again? Do we know how long it'll take for extraction to get here? Uh, it would be moments. The, sh the, 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 uh, uh, four hours and 15 minutes, sir. Yeah. Five that, hour mission, not a four hour mission. Don't be trying to steal an hour away from us. We've got five <laughs> hours in total. I, I, I understand that. You wasted 45 minutes, uh, getting to this point. Not wasted, spent. 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 <laughs> So four hours. Are oh, you talking about four hours, fifteen minutes? Yeah, yeah. Wait, how, yeah, sorry. It's not as wasted as much as the aliens wasted each other. Uh, yeah, this <laughs> is true. This guy seems special. Yeah, he's that guy that turned into paste last time that we didn't get to see doing it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. The Warriors. So we roll for our initiative. Oh yeah, you guys are as you're approaching from the west. You guys see all that I uh, described. You see it's swarming with Tyranids. Oh. So I'm last. Uh, possibly. I rolled a one. I'm last. Oops, sorry, I don't know why oh, I rolled a 100. <laughs> the aliens have all the initiative. Somebody's cheating. <laughs> no, oh. I, I d I've oh, been damn. used to the, doing the game one, 100 uh, for your guys' encounters and whatever comes up. Bugs are first. Yeah, they are. That's mm -hmm. not good. That's actually yeah. good. Well, there are a lot of melee, so we should be fine. Yeah, right. Who, who has the flamethrower? So. I have one. That would be Moth. Okay, so this one's going to come up to you. And let's see. He's going to... Oh, see shit. That is Lord. me. Yep. Oh. Ah. You can always try and dodge or parry. Alright. Can I make a dodge check against that? Yes. Uh, modifier zero, I'm guessing. Do you have any bonuses to your agility or I, squad cohesion or? I wouldn't know about the squad cohesion stuff. Your captain would. What you got, Cap? Any any way to help this poor lad? No, not for dodging or anything like that. Okay. Okay. Ooh, I dodge. Oh yeah, you gracefully died. I rolled guy. a three. Oh, holy shit! You just see it. You just see that hulking warrior come and gets lodged in the ground as you dodge out of the way. Okay. 
So I quickly go to ground with uh, with a roll. Eight. Let's work on. Do a tactical roll. Yep. Ah. The ship is only nine meters long. So I, I did find um, there is a disengage action you can take to disengage from melee so opponents don't get a free attack on you when you leave. Oh. So there is yeah, reaction attacks. Oh, it should have been five meters. So. Just Whatever. so everybody knows. No, actually, I said it's a one meter. Well, I think that, well, don't use the word reaction because that reaction is an actual... Um, it, it, it says so they get a, it's a free attack. attack, not a reaction attack. You just get a hit. Yeah, so you do get a free attack by leaving. Okay. Uh, let's see. And he's gonna attack you, Moth. Moth he's trying gonna... to dodge. Okay. There's a fleeing sidebar somewhere. So how does dodge work? Uh, you you dodge. You just it. roll a dodge test, and if you succeed at all, you dodge ah, the okay. Right. So, oop, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, so if a character flees, uh, he can't take that disengage action. So uh, you wouldn't have been able to take that uh, a reaction or a free attack against that one fling, Hermagant, in the last encounter. Without having to chase him down. No uh, quarter. Well, yeah, we're just moving the story along, so. I oh, know, we're just updating ourselves in rules as we go. Yep, that's fine. Okay, so. Oop. Yeah, I modified it because, like, yeah, it's kind of small. He said nine meters, so that's a little more correct. Uh, and it gives you a buffer not to get smacked in the face immediately. It's like, man, they can hit you pretty quick. Uh, so they're going to move up. Uh, let's see. He's going, yep, he's going to move up. And then, let's see, he's going to shoot. At the dude. At the dude of dudes. Dude, the duder of dudes. Uh-oh. <laughs> and he just shoots his own friendly instead. Yeah, so this one, this one, he just forgot to do whatever he's supposed to do to actually load the gun, or his gun, hit with bio gun. He's like, you just see little jizz come out, essentially. He jizzed at you. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. In these guys, yeah. I don't know how to describe it. It's a bio weapon, so. The aliens see. are horny. Yeah. And let's see, oh, one, two, three, oh, four, no, five, no, six, yeah. seven. Okay. All right, who's next? Me. Uh, I think I'll be the one that's next. Oh, yeah, right, right. Yeah. What's the damage radius for the grenades? It's uh, the blast radius. So if it says five, it's five meters. If it says two, it's two meters. So uh, five would be, that's radius. So that would be a diameter. Mm -hmm. No, five, five from a center. So if you're five using is that. the radius and ten is the diameter. Yeah. Okay. So if you land a grenade, and two enemies in the middle of them, and two enemies are like ten meters away, it'll hit both. Yeah. All right. Do you keep in mind allies count for targets hit. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming, uh, let's see, can I just double click to, how do I ping? I saw a ping before. I oh, think you hold down. Ruler and like, then... hold down the Alright, yeah. so these two guys are essentially in melee combat. Yep. Okay, so, but this guy isn't, right? That'd be correct. Alright. Trying to think of what's the best thing to. I'm trying to understand what the biggest threat is here. The pink one. <laughs> yeah, probably Mr. Pinkenstein. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Enemies don't have a attack of opportunity, correct? No, they that's do. just easy. Oh, they do? No, they, they do, they do, yeah. Oh, just they... That. Okay, cool. Oh, I wasn't sure. I was like, is it like D&D &D they have attack of opportunity? I was actually looking for it. Yeah, okay. if, you, if you move away from melee without disengaging first, your opponent will get a uh, free attack against you. It's not a reaction attack, it's a free attack. Alright, be right back. Yeah. I... Alright. All right. Who said, who said that? DM. Uh, Poco. DM. Uh. The GM. <laughs> Time to break the rules. <laughs> I am thinking of... I'm Reality thinking of itself freezes, suspended in time. Alright, Yilmug, uh, how big of a threat do you think that warrior is? Oh my one god. To 10? I mean, I don't know because he got obliterated the last time we encountered one, <laughs> so I don't honestly know. Because I would like I just, to enter friendly. Yeah, I just know that uh, in lore, they're a threat to space marines. Like All right, that one All right. All right. What are you doing? Nothing. Well, I'm thinking of throwing a grenade in just a way so it just hit three critters, but not us. I mean, if you throw it behind them far enough, but I don't know if melee combat makes it so that, like, two people in melee are on the spot. same tile. I mean, you're not shooting into melee with it. Uh, but I mean, just, you know, don't miss. Because <laughs> the grenade can scatter. Right. Yeah, I guess it's, it's like a, it's a modifier, I guess. A difficulty modifier for that, I guess. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so... So which one I put in for the modifier? Uh, well, who are you aiming at? I'm kind of aiming it towards in the middle, and uh, between these three guys. So it's far away enough so it doesn't hit our friendly, but uh, close enough to hit them. Uh, so like where I'm pinging. Yeah. yeah. So do hmm, that seems like a fairly straightforward shot you're trying to do behind them. So uh, just a flat, flat zero. Flat zero. Yeah, flat zero. Because you are trying to Thank aim and Thank God you got uh, that. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, that's hit, not damage. That's a frag or is that a crack? Uh, a frag. frag. Uh, cracks frag don't is... have blast. Cracks are just single target only. Are they? Four, uh, yeah. Uh, also, frag grenades don't have penetration. Yeah. No, they yeah. don't. They don't. They don't. No, the they pen don't. should be zero on that. Mm -hmm. I'm, gonna, I, I'm gonna look at the book again because I yeah, think I, have zero crack. pen. Cracks have six pen. Yeah, that, that's what that I've got. just takes it. She doesn't even yeah. flinch. Mm -hmm. Depends what their armor the is. Frag missile just under it, which has These guys get hurt. Well, the warrior might have taken one damage at least. Warrior has eight armor. No, oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, so a crack to uh, the warrior might be good. Wow. Okay. I'm still looking at. Uh, it is zero pen. Okay. I definitely did not write that correctly. Okay. Should I just do another damage or just leave it be? No, that's fine. Uh, we'll just ignore uh, the, the pen part unless you want to roll for more damage. I mean, yeah. Do I have any action left? I mean, GM says okay, so you know, try and get better than the seven. <laughs> hey, better than seven. <laughs> yep. And do I have any action remaining? Uh, standard action throw, so you should have another half action left. Half action? Yeah. Am I able to shoot with half action? No. I think it's full action shoot. Like no, not unless you have multiple attack feet. No, you can only attack once. Yeah. Can you, can you move throw up a grenade to somebody? Twice. Mm -mm. Can you throw a gr uh, can you throw two grenades in the same turn? I don't think so. Might be able to attack more than once. Yeah, but we can. I can throw. I then I want to throw another one, but only if we can. It says you can only attack once unless you have the multi attack feet. Okay. Right. Or or righteous fury. 
<laughs> as <laughs> as we're all aware of by now. Uh, someone was looking for uh, the two weapon fighting thing. That's on page two. Yeah, I, I found it. Okay. I was I was reading it. That's why it took me so long to do stuff. Okay. Cool. Now, since, oh, I can probably do a move then. Do a half mood move. Are we in squad mode? Yes. Yeah. So you get a free half move, and then you can do another half move. <laughs> as your half action. Right. So technically, I can just do 12 then. It must be nice to have a good agility bonus. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to fall back a little bit more, and that's it. And also, that's all I can nice have a good toughness bonus. Sorry, these, these, these guys had the old tokens of the Hermit Gods. Alright, I end my turn. Okay. Ooh, Boko, I think you're a little far from your mic. Yeah, sorry. Um, I think it's my Actually, turn now. Is... Yep, go for it. It is Karnath. Uh, I would like then to bolt straight towards the warrior and uh, attack it. Okay. Uh, avoiding this. Can I ping? No. All right, but avoiding the, the enemy basically is just kind of here, standing here. If I can nudge my, myself between those two space marines. Yeah, you will find to replace the token. You're yeah. like, pardon me, brothers. Excuse me, me, but brothers. I need to get to the battle. <laughs> because the warrior is like no joke. I need to help out. Okay, I uh, hit. Do I get any? That's just, just, just a zero, right? He is outnumbered now, so I mean, you might get a bonus. So it's yeah, there a thing on that. Yeah. Um, is, is there is there a bonus for that? Or is that there is. There is an overwhelming. Yeah. yeah, there was a. There's like a list of like bonuses you get when you make the attack roll uh, on page uh, two forty seven for standard like situations. Um, melee attacks against a foe who is outnumbered two to one plus ten. No, that's what I was thinking. It was, I think it was, yeah, it seemed like a plus 10 thing. Okay, plus 10. Yeah. Whew. All right. Nice. So that's going to be two hits or one hit? It's just one hit. One hit. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, that's sorry. That's hit. That's not for damage. <laughs> Wrong kind of hit. There you go. Ooh. Okay, so he takes 20 damage to what location? Well, he's got a pin of four, so he'll take 24 damage. Oh, 24. Yeah. Uh, to 93, and that is... Let's see where it's at. It's a leg. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's hurting. He lopped off one of his legs. Nice. <laughs> Good. Hey, okay, who's next? I believe I am next, but let me double check. Uh, you are next. Yeah, you are yeah. next. I okay. okay. suggest disengage is a thing you can do. Yes, I know, but that's not what I want to do. So I'm going to uh, unsheath my Stardust Combat Knife and lunge at the uh, pink pink guy in front of me. Oh, what? sure about that. Do I get a plus 10 modifier? Uh... Let's see. Yeah, you're still outnumbering him. Yeah. yeah. All right. You could have just shot him point blank as well. But I'm not doing that. Ah, oh, shit. Let's see. You <laughs> try to hit him with your combat knife, and it just falls out of your hand. It's a hard, you stroke so hard, it just bounced off his armor, and <laughs> under the ground. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, we huh. didn't go over it. Did I get my chainsword back from that dude's corpse? <laughs> I you fucking hope so. so. <laughs> I assume I just grabbed it. <laughs> that depends on how much of a dick Thomas wants it to be right now. <laughs> well, what was that? Oh, it was 93, right? So during during our last... No, no, no. During our last encounter, Moth tried using his chainsword and he dropped it and it tore up the dirt. And he's asking yeah. if he retrieved it or not. I imagined it was just a matter of pulling it out of the ground, but I never actually see. specifically mentioned it. I know. 
I'm a GM roll, that. maybe? No, uh, I'm I rolled that. a 96, yeah. Yeah, okay. So you just plum forgot it. <laughs> <laughs> At least you stole the combat knife. As in real life, as in the game, you just plum forgot it back there. You just like... Mm, nice. Just like forgetting your car's keys. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's how far above you are, these alien creatures. You killed it and immediately forgot its entire existence. <laughs> With yeah. your sword. Including in how ground. you killed it. Yeah. You can still shoot point blank. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, who's next? Is it my turn right now? Uh, I think so. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, are you not going, Moth, or...? I'm last. Oh, okay. I was just making sure when my turn came up if I had the sword or not. Yeah. The oh. person who's next is the snake tactical. Okay. I will shoot this termagant. Okay. Right here. Um, and I'm just going to do an aim shot. Uh, instead of doing an all-out, because I feel that's unnecessary on these. Right. And the last couple guys in the <laughs> pace. Of course I missed with that. Of course. If I had done a full, if I had done a full auto, I would have hit him, but whatever. Simple miss. You grazed oh, no. him. Yeah, we grazed him. Do doom. Okay. Rista. Who's next? Yo. Go. Well, I don't have my sword, so <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm gonna shoot this guy with a shotgun. Oh, you have a shotgun? You yeah. have a shotgun? I do. Hey, remember, yeah, you get a plus 30 for point blank. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's mounted on my shoulder. Yep, go oh. for it. To grab that. Oh, good hey, thing you have plus thirty. Are you shooting the hermit guy in front of you? Yeah, yeah, the one in melee. No pen. Wait, no uh, pen? Is, it doesn't have zero. penetration, but scattering does something. I think it is. Okay. It hits multiple mm -hmm. areas on them and does more damage. Oh, it does? Yeah, I'm just trying to find it. That'd be grave. It does like six, six damage all across this whole body. It does three armor all around, so. He took a definite gut punch of that shotgun bus. He screeches and reels in pain. <laughs> okay, if I were to foe within two. Uh. Fire at a foe within point blank every two degrees of success indicates another hit. No. So yep. it, it does nine damage. Yep. To yep. his leg. I blew its leg off. <laughs> Notice uh, a pattern with you guys at the front lines. <laughs> All right, next. My leg! The bugs is next. Bugs? Yeah. The bugs. I have a Lord Lord Lord, damn it. Ah. And a warrior. <laughs> I have that list of initiative, so I'm actually can I can visually see who's next. Who is that warrior attacking? Yeah, I should. Which one uh, has an initiative thing inside of it? Oh, it does where? Yeah, no, it's a GM feature thing. You get to like initialize it, but yeah, it, it does exist as a GM tool. Yeah, I do remember that. Now, I know it also, uh, for D&D stuff, you will hit initiative and it'll bring it up for anybody rolling yeah. it. But yeah. there's no initiative button for uh, Death Watch, so it may not exist with the Death Watch version. Yep. I'll get it. I'll get it. Text. I think it's the only thing slowing, slowing us up. Is, okay. Uh, I right. still have a half a turn left, so I'm going to knock down this dude in front of me. Oh, you still oh. had half a turn. Oh, yeah, go for it. 
Alright. I'm just finding out specifically what I'm supposed to pull here. You can do that after firing your shotgun? See, wouldn't that count as a second action? Or a second I, attack? I didn't use a full round attack, it was a half attack, just shoot. Right, but didn't we state that you can only make one attack around? Yeah, knockdown's not an attack. Is okay. it? Oh, it is an attack. It is an attack. Fuck. Alright. Well, never mind. Uh, Oh, <clears throat> so Iron the Man, warrior, who's it attacking? Hold on. It's attacking the tactical. Actually, who's the ah. one who sliced him up? Is I'm going to be. He's going to slide. He's going to attack you. He's going to attack you. Wait. I was like, there, oh, there he is. I maneuvered. Okay. Karnoff, then. Uh, so what is it? Is it a weapon skill? For the parry? Yes, parry is weapon skill. All right. And then minus 10 because of the unwieldy. Yes. Nice. You parried it. Yeah, your guy goes up, ah, blocks that big old scythe coming in. <laughs> I just like put my, both of my hands on my blade and just like block it to its attack. Hey, right, this Hormagoth is kind of pissed off at Mr. Moth here, so it is going to attack him. Because <clears throat> it is, you know, not happy with you. Once you're Moth. Moth. Well, Sir Moth can try and dodge this hit. Um, I think but it's also a Hermagot, so you could just soak the damage. Yeah, I think you're yeah. just going to save it for a range hit coming at me or something. Okay. Oh, Jesus, okay. you're taking that damage. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> and that hit where? Let's see. Ah, no, not. Get fucked. What'd you do? My shield proc the trigger. It overloaded, but I don't take the hit. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> yeah, he was angry with you, man. Uh, let's see, okay. Now the Termagant is going to shoot. I mean, I wouldn't have taken any damage anyway. Are you sure? Uh, What's your armor? It's 20, 20 damage. 20 with yeah. three pins. 20 with three pins, so 23 total. Not 23 total. Well, 23, well, it, like, if you have 23 armor, it will go... Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's good. Yeah. He's firing into combat, minus 20. Uh, ooh. Ah, that's... <laughs> that one. He's gonna hit you, uh, Moth. Oh, wait, who's hitting me now? A different the Termagant. Termagant. He's firing into combat at you. Oh, shit, okay. Guy with purple sniper rifle. He right? does nothing. Uh, tearing, uh, Storm, Devourer. Gotcha, gotcha. And what does Storm do? Let me look that up. I wrote this down somewhere. Where does it, where does it hit you? It would hit you in the head, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, bounce off the armor. I think 20 hit her. It's the roll? Oh, he rolled a 1, so yeah, that'd be the head. <laughs> So it hits you in the head for 12. It is tearing and storm. Uh, it's the devourer. So weapon. tearing means you roll another 1d10 and replace the lowest die result. Mm. So oh, it's only 1d10, so... He doesn't change the damage then. <laughs> yeah, so the damage is the same because his original damage was better. Okay. And uh, I guess I could have done storm? that storm? Storm? Uh, doubles the number of hits inflicted on the target. Oh, so hit again. Well, I think it just means he rolls t damage twice. So... But are those considered separate attacks? Or the now, same? I'm reading the, the full thing here. Uh, weapon of Storm quality unleashes rapid shots, often through the double roll design. This quality doubles the number of hits inflicted on the target and the amount of ammunition expended. For example, when firing a weapon with the Storm quality in fully automatic mode, each of its success yields two additional hits to a maximum of the weapons. Yeah, so I think every hit is two hits. So he hit you twice with that one hit. Right, but will these count as separate hits then? That's yes, armor still, they are still separate hits. All yes. right, so it hits the armor, does nothing. Hits the armor, does nothing. Well, hang on. <laughs> the damage is uh, 15, but 20, it's... 20 armor, no penetration. On the head? Yeah. Damn. All right. We all have 20 head armor. You guys are immune. Yeah. I have 17 You're... head armor. I have oh, Because my toughness, toughness is a 33. Oof. Do you have a helmet? Yes. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, like, this would have been model does it for whatever reason. Yeah, that would have killed you if you had not had that. Uh, let's see. Let's see. One, two, three, four. And then I'm going to have. Five, oh, shit. Six, and seven. All right. Next, people. It is over. That would be my turn then. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Let's see here. I fire. At the closest about where or the range person. Oh my god. Yeah. With good. the uh fire bolter fire selector. Alright, get it going boy. Rip it up. And I'm gonna do twenty modifier, right? I believe so. Yeah, open field. If you're doing a full auto, it's plus twenty, yeah. And I do double two damage or just one? Uh, well, if you did full auto, you hit four times. Uh, yeah, you got five degrees of success there. Five hey. degrees. Well, that was five. Well, you only hit four because you hit, uh, it only goes up to four. Right. Yeah. So we ignore the last one then. Yeah. Yep. But uh, you roll, uh, need to roll four uh, 1d10s. Well, it'll probably obliterate him, but. He's obliterated, so go ahead and uh, describe how you kill this guy. So who we? Oh, that's why. Okay. Oh yeah. Explain how you t kill this termagon here. Did these like? I mega see you, the mill, uh, the bat, the melee battle in front of me. I take aim at the closest ranged. Uh, termagon, right? Termagon, yeah. Termagon. And I breathe in and out. And as I breathe out, I fired a shot, going straight and fire straight through his heart. Entire being has exploded into pink cloud. Very nice. Nice. All right. Next person. I think that is Karma. I will. I would like to spend my full action to get into frenzy. Go for it. So, what do I need to roll for that? Or is it, is, it, is it just a thing I can do? Uh, does it cost any cohesion points? Is it like a squad mode ability, or is that a solo ability? That's just, that's just a talent I can do. Well, then I guess you just use it. I guess I just use it. Then it's just I just skip my turn. You're now frenzied. Okay, so I believe it well, is mine. It, that's a blood frenzy, right? That's... I think it's just called frenzy. Let me check. Mm. Uh, yeah, it's just called frenzy. Oh, okay. So I believe it is my turn next. You guys scream. Bruh! Yep, go. It's okay. Karnath. Karnath is next after I go. No, he just went. He just uh, frenzied. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's he, your turn then. He screamed at the monster angrily. Bruh! <laughs> 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 okay, so um, I'm going to try and recover my combat knife since I accidentally yeeted it last turn. So do I need to like roll for agility or something to see if I can pick it up? Let's make it a free action. It only drop next to you. All right. So I I'm pick not up that big of a dick. But <laughs> <laughs> so I pick up my combat knife and uh, I'm going to level my bolt pistol on this guy who's right in front of me and try to hit him point blank. Thirty. Plus thirty. Yeah. All right. Three zero. All right. Three point eight. Oh. So does Who that mean? No, no, no. Hang on. I am. Uh, I'm this guy right here. So I'm hitting. I'm hitting this pink fucker. Pinky. Pinky needs to die. Pinky in the brain. All right. Pinky in the brain. You know, there's a. Uh, I just want to say this real quick. There's a fan theory that uh, Pinky is actually the smart one because, like, Brain fucks up all the time, and then Pinky ends yeah, did up. Did you being... ever watch the show? Pinky's not the smart one. 
Vicky's well, not the smart one. No. No, <laughs> but like Pinky he solved the idea, and actually they took they did Vicky's idea. Pinky took over the world. Oh, yeah. True. One time he did it. Like <laughs> <laughs> monkeys was dead. Brain brain overthinks stuff, and then Pinky the is like he was given a chance. Pinky. Same. Pinky is like Occam's razor, so he usually succeeds, whereas Brain doesn't. Mm -hmm. So, like, Brain will think he's trapped in a cage, and then Pinky will, like, step between the bars and get the key, and then unlock it, and then go back inside mm -hmm. and push the door open. Anyway, mm -hmm. uh, okay. So, three degrees of success. Does that mean I roll for three hits? If you did a full auto attack, yes. It's if bolt your bolt pistol can do that. I don't uh, know if... Pistol can do a semi-auto, so it can only go up to three. So I can do three hits? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. All right. Go for it. Holy shit. Oh, yes. Hey, look, another attack. Five, so th oh, dude, yeah, he's, um... All right. How much damage? <laughs> uh, 16 plus 18 plus 20. That's roughly a lot. Minus well, nine. It's over 40. It's well, 50. remember, he has five, ten. because That's it's a tearing point. weapon, you get to roll an extra to d10 for each of those damage rolls and replace uh, the lowest result and just and discard the lowest uh, value. All right. I'm just going to do roll 3d10. I'm pretty sure you killed this guy, though. So. Seven, yeah, nine, so. and two. So the first one... It's better than a two for uh, your first one. Oh, he's dead. So. He's dead. He's just he, dead. He's, he's dead as shit. Dead. He's fucking yeah, dead as yeah. shit. And he's tough, but he ain't invincible. Also, you would have gotten another chance at another hit roll because of that 10 for your third yeah. damage roll. Yeah. So uh, I pull out my bolt pistol. I pistol whip this guy in the head to stun him. And then I, uh, I proceed to blow off uh, his remaining three limbs. And then shoot him in the face. <laughs> well, you only have to shoot. Breathe like, fuck, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Alright. Alright. So, next person. I think I should have gone with. Is that me now? Looks like. Uh, I'm Snake Tactical. Yes. Yeah. It's you. It's because I can't, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Ancius. Ancius. Okay. I definitely was mispronouncing in my head. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, I think one of the, the Greek warriors from the Argo. Oh, okay. Argonauts, chap. Yeah, yeah he's right. one of the Argonauts, Ancius. Uh, cool. I'm gonna charge, uh... Okay. Boop, this guy, and, uh, an attack. On the nose. <laughs> Do I get any uh, other modifiers and just my basic charge bottom fire? Yep, basic charge bottom It's open ground. You know, no difficulty here. I'm saying, do I gain any other modifiers other than my charge modifier? Plus ten, just because open ground, pretty easy, pretty standard affair. Going on charging in the battle. I hit him. Ooh. Do your damage. Ooh. Oh man, that thing is is hurting so bad. Got it right in the eye. <laughs> really in pain. Ah! Catch her in the eye. That little little monster. All right, who's next? Well, wait, if it's rending, does that mean he gets another attack? How does that work? Make up rending. No, it can uh, substitute one of the lower values, <laughs> I guess. Well, that's tearing. Tearing is oh, your one extra okay. d10. Uh, rending is something else. Uh, oh, uh, okay. Let's see. Which is? Uh, finding it right now. Bleed? Oh, why is it not listed? Uh, all damage by the four type blah, 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 rending, blah, blah, blah. Oh, no, it's just rending damage. That's the damage type. It doesn't have any traits other than balanced. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, so that's just the type of damage, like piercing or explosive or impact. 
So if he were to roll on the crit table, he would roll on the rending table. Okay. Uh -huh. Did you crit? Uh, no. you tell me. Did I do more than his wounds? <laughs> no. He has more than 19 wounds, okay. Or he has more than 18 wounds, because I think his armor is three. Oh, yeah. All right. But you got him in the eye. God. If they have 18 wounds, that means they're almost as tough as Space Marines. As far as wounds go. As far as the weak Space Marines go. I'm really not tough, so yeah. Again, I've been just, as soon as they reached uh, toughness zero, I've just been eating them. Cool. All yeah, right, that was my turn. All right. Next. Sylvestra. Right, yeah, it's my turn. Uh, so I should be able to move and then fire an attack, correct? You're in uh, you can move 10, 10, 10 meters. Yes. Yeah. Because that dude in front of me is still alive. The hermit got. Yeah. And he's probably going to get a hit off on me if I move. Right. Which I'm just going to take. Uh, where's 10 meters? All right there. I'm gonna move over about here. Take whatever attack he's gonna throw at me. Uh, you just stomp him. He just dies. He, just... <laughs> <laughs> he travel over him. He's he's just so weakened by that leg leg uh being blown off earlier. You just trample him to death. Nice. <laughs> How heavy From... is a space marine in their full combat hey, armor? It's like a ton. One time, yeah, air, air, yeah, pretty heavy. Right, yeah. yeah, so you just go, pow, pow, he's goo. From where we're standing, can I see the entrance to this uh, spaceship? You see the the cockpit, yeah. The cockpit, all right. Yeah. See it, yeah. like moth trampling that guy. It's the equivalent of stepping in dog shit, because then it's stuck yeah. to your feet. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops, I stepped in shit. <laughs> Guess I'm gonna shoot this guy over here. Okay. Go for it. Burn, burn, burn. Or not. Oh shit. Let's see what you get. 89. <sighs> Holy shit. That's not good. Yep, you just whisk. You miss. You're off by a lot. You're just, your adrenaline's up. You miss dramatically. <laughs> Doesn't. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I wiped the blood off my Pfizer. Damn it. <laughs> your targeting apparatus is way whack. So you miss by a lot. <laughs> you miss. And your mag falls. Okay, next. Right. And and what? The Miss and what? Yeah, and you your mag falls. Oh. It's, it's the bug's turn. Yeah. So your magazine falls out of your gun? Does that mean you have to reload? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> There's not only a well oiled your chainsword, also your boat pistol. <laughs> he used too much gun I oil when he cleaned it. I clip closed enough last time I reloaded it. And the chainsword, I, I just, I was not holding it right. Right. Yeah, they're coming at you. They're making their full movements. Your magazine wasn't fully into the gun. It didn't latch properly. Okay. Surprise. So this is going to attack you, Aenseus. He's going to try and attack me. Yeah, I know. Yeah, any any it certainly hits me. Ooh. I'm going to try and make a parry attack. Or a parry. And I parried it. All right, uh, how much degrees of success? 34. 
Okay. What? If it was higher, I would have done, done something cool for you, but it ain't high oh. enough. Oh, okay. You do parry it, he goes, tries to, and you just block it off. <laughs> like it was nothing. All right. Uh, it let's... was nothing. Yeah. Who's next? That's I'm next. Okay. Oh. All righty. Let me pull my sheet up. Wait, whose turn is it? Dudes. Dude. Dude. Just so people are aware, I do have a flamethrower that I couldn't fire off in melee, but I can now with these three dudes in front of me. Right. So who's after dude? Don't don't rush into melee with them. Wait, so wait, Tom, Thomas, <laughs> wait, GM did a turn, did then uh, test. Yeah, really bad. I, I got, I got. I got dude, and then who's after dude? Turn counter. Karnoff. Karnoff? Yes. Karn okay, and then who? Neil Tyron. Oh, oh yeah. Oh good. Oh good. Yeah. Never mind. I'm just. Hey. Down. Wait, didn't dude right, go or not yet? I don't um, know. I'm, yeah. I'm just. I'm just. Okay. Doing it on my end, so I don't have to ask anymore. Uh, and then after that, there there is a D20, uh, uh, a roll twenty turn counter going on. Is there it's where? Just, I don't know where it is, but I know it exists. It's a GM. Right. Like yeah. a GM should have access to it. I don't know where, though. Uh, yeah, exactly. I'm not seeing it. Uh, let's see, you got dice options. Yeah. Oh, enable 3D dice. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, I think it should be one of the things on the left. Let me see. I'm looking. Enable 3D dice is per person. Like, I have mine enabled. I don't think anyone else does. Oh, okay. oh yeah, yeah so it's 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 the clock, Thomas. Yeah, there it is. Uh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Order. I see it. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Sweet. It's a little dingus. Oh, now. And you guys add your guys' turn order on your side? Yeah, you right click, -click your token, token. Uh, and choose add a turn. Or you can use control U to quickly add groups. I'm right clicking my token. Nothing's happening. I think Boko has to do it, yeah. The turn order on my screen. There are currently any. There aren't any, currently any tokens on this page. That's that takes a turn. Yeah, yeah, that's that's the same for me. For, same for everyone. Uh, oh, I hit Control U, and that did not do oh, what I did. Oh, okay, so let's see. Okay, I can add you guys on my end. Yeah. So who is it again? Good. So the first one are bugs. First. Then Domingo. Uh, Domingo. I don't see where you're at. Aren't like the bugs the first? Yeah, we should the probably bugs the bugs first. first. We can always, you should oh, always yeah. be able to manually change the order. I'll just, uh, oh yeah, I'll just add a token that that doesn't die. Uh, let's see. And that number, you can change that to whatever our roll was. Mm -hmm. oh, we're not worried about that right now. I'll, I'll do that next time. Okay. Uh, the numbers too. I do have the numbers with me. Okay. Uh, what's one. So for the bugs, it's 13. Okay. Then Domingo, which is 12. Wait, where's Domingo at? Oh, there he is. Far left. Okay, that's why I didn't see you. Okay, then <laughs> yours is what? 12. All right. Yeah, this is much better. All right. Next one's Karnath, on 11. 11? 11, yes. All right. Next one Next. is Neil Tyron, 10. Another one is uh, Anacious, which is eight. I still probably butchered that. By the way, add not names to your tokens, guys. You can like click on your token, then in settings, there's like name, add a name yep. to your token. You can only yeah, see the all... name of your own token, though, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the tokens are named. I see all your guys' names. You're all named. Oh, uh, okay. That's it. All right. Okay. Yeah, it's Last... only for yourself. <laughs> Last one is Sylvester, which is five. Oh man, that yeah, rolled low. Okay, whose whose current turn is it? It's still my turn, and I would use the bolt with fire selector to get the guy north of us. Wait, yeah, that's so much better. Yeah, it's pretty nice. 
All right, go for it. Let's see. Okay, roll your damage. It's four damage, right? Now, who are you firing at again? Is it a Hummer Uh, The guy in the north. Yeah. Okay. He's gonna try to that guy. I just need to do four, right? Oh. Uh, he dodged. He like uh, somersaulted out of your bolter fire there. Dang. He's cartwheeling like one of those Power Ranger villains. No. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if one of y'all want to spend a fate point and make him not do that, that's fine. The party won't be, a, be opposed to it. I think we'll. I think we'll be good. Okay. Cool. All right, and then there's your action. That's my action. All right, Karnoth, go. I can go to the bathroom right. and be right back. All right. Uh, then I will. <sighs> uh, question to you, Mug. So there's yes. a talent called Tower Defense, and it says that you may spend a fate point as a full action. So you can substitute a fate point for a full action to activate it. Yeah. I'm presuming. I'm asking. Okay. Uh. Total defense, you said? Stal stalwart. Stalwart defense. Stalwart defense. Is that a trait or a uh, talent or something? That's a talent. That's a talent. Okay, let me find it. Uh, page 121, I think. Ooh, I'm back. All right, by the way, you also have the other three space, space marines. They're just kind of like, you guys sent them on a scouting mission or something. Oh. No, sorry, that's 127. Yeah, a question. So uh, to DM, there is a talent called Tower Defense, where it says you, a battle forever, may spend a fate point as a full action. So I can substitute a fate point for a full action to use that talent. I think That's it's really you're taking your full action to to adopt the uh, Tower Defense, and you also have to spend the fate point. Uh, you may not move. You may not dodge. You may make a parry reaction against all attacks. Yes. And all damage uh, he suffers is reduced by two. Yes. Uh, you're, I think you're taking the full action to go into that stance. And you have to spend a fate point to do it. Okay, got it. All right. Then in that case, I will uh, charge into uh, these guys. And also, it can be presumed that we are fighting a horde at the moment. I mean, no, there's a lot of enemies. No? Well, no, we're not. Which guys are you going for again? What? Which guy is you driving into again? I'm driving into the middle guy here. Into this one. Oh, wait, sorry. Sorry, sorry. There you go. Ah. Can I ask you to not go for those three specifically? Because they're about to be on fire. Very well. <laughs> hey, go for that guy. Uh, yeah, I, not I can't, that guy. I can't hit the race yeah, guy back or the other dude do this shit, but I can hit those three specifically. Mm, is there more? Yeah, it's okay. I, yeah, I, I can charge for that one. Sure. I'm going to charge for this one. Thank you. Uh, Sorry to mess with your turn. I can make it without using my... Actually, can Yeah, I can make it without using my jetpack, so I will do that. So I will just charge and do a melee attack. Must be nice to have a good agility. <laughs> so yes. you're enraged or whatever, so what does that do for you? So that makes me have a plus 10 bonus to my hits. Oh, uh, if you're frenzied, you have to go after the closest enemy. Oh, closest. Right. Yeah. Which would probably be the one I'm fighting. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm going to gonna help you out. <laughs> I could use it. All right. He's going to so, help uh, you out whether he likes it or not. Yes. Uh, okay, if the assistance. So that would be a plus 10 on my hit. Which it also makes me have a plus 10 on my strength, on my toughness, on my willpower, but uh, and I'm immune to fear, pinning, and stun. Also, so, if you just charge, that's another plus 10. And he's help. outnumbered for another plus 10. So you should have a plus 30 on this attack. Oh, right. <laughs> he is mega fucked. Yeah. All right. Oh. oh. <laughs> Good thing you got it, too, because you just barely hit. <laughs> Uh, all right. God and damn! Oh, wait, no damage. Oh, nice. <laughs> you can make another attack. Well, I don't need to. 
she yeah, said. Yeah, but you may as well. I mean, come on, let's. Uh, all right, all right, fine. Yeah, yeah. All right, fine, F fine. You gotta those overkill damage. the ever living. Those, those were damages, not attack die. rolls. Yeah. If you get a 10, you have to make an actual attack roll again. Oh, attack roll again, not a damage yeah. roll. Yeah, oh. yeah, it's another attack roll. All the same. Oh, bones. sorry. Yeah. So, plus 30? Yep. Same modifiers. All right, yeah. Okay, well, that one missed. All right, so it's just the first damage. Yeah, the first damage. You know, just 37 points of damage. Sorry, I'll... There you go. It's tearing. It's supposed to be tearing. There you go. Oh, is it tearing? It's tearing, yes. Oh, well, then you could... I don't think you can get a better roll than uh, a 10 and a 9. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just you saying. can try. <laughs> <laughs> you you oh, can man, roll crap. another D10 and try and go for another D10. No, 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 this guy's dead. We don't know this guy's dead. No, no. We're, well, Tom we're hasn't dead. said anything yet. He hasn't said he's well, dead. Well, I mean, there's no kill like overkill. Exactly. Right. You are death right. watch. And there's no better uh, Tyranid than a super dead Tyranid. All right, so it's yeah. two D10. Fine. The roll only good D10. Tyranid is a dead Tyranid brother. Oh, wait, no, it's... It was just 1d10, but neither one, one of those is better than a 9, so... Yeah. yeah. You, you rolled he's as best super, you could. He's super dead. He's su he's just super yeeted out of this out of this world. <laughs> yes. He got yoked. Yes. And he uses a chain where magic happens, and he obliterated... Tell Past tense of yeet <laughs> is yoked. Yeet is the present partici participle. True. Uh, true, true. Your turn over? My turn is over. All right. Okay. So it's uh, now... Neil Tyrant. It's not my turn. So, yeah. what I would nice like feature. to do... Oh, yeah. How do I have my name in there no one else's? Well, I only see my name in there. Oh. So I can yeah, you move... only see your own token's name. Unless uh, you can somehow make it public. The so. the other tokens need to be shared for you to see them. So you know where your turn is. Yeah. Gotcha. So I'm going to move... Up to here, and let's see. I'm trying to get a range on these two fuckers. So if I throw a grenade, that strength bonus times three. So I believe my strength bonus is four, so I can go twelve. Is it twelve or one hundred and twenty? Do we decide on that? Twelve. I okay. think it's 12, because that's a normal right. grenade toss. Yep. Well, I'm not going to bother tossing a grenade then. I'm just going to... Wait, wait, is that based off your strength bonus? Yeah, strength bonus. Remember, your strength bonus is multiplied by 3, because you're a yeah, super so... Human. Well, so it's 12 plus... times than whatever the throwing but distance. His, his strength bonus is 4. Yeah, because right, so I, be my strength is 41. Is Times three right. is twelve, and then twelve times three would be uh, 36. thirty-six. The thirty-six would be the distance that you can yeah. throw. Right. Well, I'm not going to be able to. I don't think I can hit these guys with a grenade anyway. Yeah, so throwing you know. a grenade near that chip. Well, is you do bad. have a free. Uh, I'm not. A free, I'm not uh, throwing move. near the ship. I'm throwing these two purple, pink, pink guys, pinkies. Because you do have a free ten meters movement. Well, I moved. I moved my charge speed from, like, here. Oh, so you've already moved for this action. Yeah, but, like, there's charge, and then I guess there's run, and... Well, I no, think the, there's the, the tactical move thing that everybody gets as a free. Yep. Like 10, 10 meters. So, technically, I can do, like... I can Is do another 10 meters. Move or free half move, or what do we get there? I think it's... I thought it was a full move. Let me find it again. So if that's true, I could I could move another ten meters and then hit the hit these guys with a grenade. Oh, uh, maybe not. Are you, are you worried about these guys? Yeah, I'm. I wanna I wanna attack them. You can Overwatch. Yeah, yeah I'm, the, I'm not. Thing. As they come in, I'm not gonna it's Overwatch. One advance. Uh, you can make a tactical user. Oh, you're using a reaction, though, to uh, make a tactical advance, uh, which is yeah. uh, the action. Probably won't need your reaction. I'm, I'm just gonna not... You. Okay. I'll say this. I'm just not going to bother throwing a grenade. I'm going to... Which is a full move. I'm going to try and... Oh, shit, that's the wrong button. You should be able to shoot 60 meters with the pistol if you take a minus. I think it's well, like I can, I can shoot... 
Yeah, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to shoot with my uh, bolter, which is 100 meters. Ah. So mm -hmm. I'm going to I'm going to aim for this guy on the bottom, the bottom two, the rightmost from my perspective. So uh, modifier on that, Boko. Is that uh, half your range, open, clear, clear ground, essentially uh, give you a ten. All right, ten it is. Oh shit! Rolled an eighty-three. Yeah, eighty-three. So yeah, minus two point eight. You forgot to reload. You forgot to reload here. Ah oh, shit! Mm -hmm. Click is what you get. You get a big solid click. <laughs> Yeah, deal, it appears so right. I forgot to reload, brothers. <laughs> kind of oh, 3D, brother. What kind of 3D dice off? <laughs> I thought it'd be cooler than that. Oh, I did, how did My, I unlock uh, the personal? Oh, that's neat. I didn't know you could do that. Along with uh, Moth's character, my magazine also falls out of my gun. Well, it didn't fall out. You just, um... You just never reload. put it in. Yeah. yeah. You, just, you just forgot to reload. You just... Silly me. Yeah, I, oh, um... You. When okay, I, uh... Was that character at, uh, less than half? Which character? The less one he shot at? What? Yeah. Well, if, uh, because short range bonus is another 10 if the target is, uh, at half or less than your, uh, range. Still miss. I wouldn't have hit anyway. Yeah, I still miss, but I'm just saying for future reference here. We got to okay. remember all of these amazing bonus modifiers that we mm -hmm. get. Right. Mm -hmm. You don't want. Yeah, you don't want me to be the. Dick. It's essentially, how to prevent Tom from being a super dick. Let me <laughs> fix. These, let me fix these tokens though, because they're the old tokens. Yeah, much better. Yeah, I. Uh... Are you done? I forgot to I forgot to put a magazine in before cycling the bolt and it ejected the one round that was in the chamber. So my gun is completely dry when I tried shooting. Hey, oh, so yeah. Marine, you're supposed to know how to operate machinery. I'm hey, sorry, I had a lapse in judgment. To be fair, <laughs> there is a difference between uh, theoretically knowing how to do it and actually having done it. Yeah, right. no, that's true. You clearly need more experience in the field of battle. That's, that's... This will soon be rectified. <laughs> My turn? It's your turn. Oh, yeah. Um, I think I have to fix those homergons, too. Give me a second. Oh, Rectify. Like, I can see the Don't talk about my warriors. rectum like that. Uh, they're using the old tokens I had. That was... mm -hmm. Okay, well, uh, since um, full auto is clearly the way to go, uh, I'm just going to full auto. Oh, one of those guys just disappeared. Hey, he's reappeared. No, I'm fixing the tokens. Like, I'm going to shoot that guy just because he's no he irritated me. His presence annoyed me <laughs> enough. I'm uh, shooting that guy. Okay. Definitely yeah. within half. That's the one that managed to dodge my shot. I will <laughs> rectify that right now. <laughs> Full bridge rectifier. Oh. Yeah, I think he's dead. Are he's you doing the full auto? Oh, he just he just <laughs> face takes all of it. He's just like, right. Duh. yeah, he's this guy. Okay, so just describe how he killed this. He poor dodges soul. into the bullet. Yeah, he does his little back awesome backflip yeah. into, into all into four bullets. <laughs> <laughs> he dodges into all four bullets. <laughs> A nice tice grouping. Uh, he dodged. He rolled forward instead of out of the side, and just. In a chain of explosions, just kills himself. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice. All right. That's my turn. Sweet. Okay. All right. So let's 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 sail. Let's go. Alrighty. So. Ich I liebe in meinen Flammenwerfer. Right. Yes. And uh, yeah. these poor bastards all need to roll agility checks. Everybody uh, within. Is this guy within 20 or not? I'm going to say yes. All right, then all four roll agility check. Okay. Uh, let's see. You can also just move two meters so you can be inside. Three. 
And then the Termagant. Let's see. Wow. And then. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> well, their base is 55, so. Oof. So, what were we trying to do? And I'm going to describe what. Fire. Trying to flamethrower all of them. Uh, oh, they, they kind of duck, dodge, and weave your fire. And you're like, Rah! <laughs> the five deeds of dodgeball. Dodge, duck, dip, dive, yeah. and dodge. They mm -hmm. they backflip out of there. They loaded the truck with their little... <laughs> 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 Every single one is doing backflips around your fire. Fire dancing. And they backflip much more successfully than the last monster who managed to but dodge into yeah. the bullets. You know, you know what the worst part about this is? They take no damage. Oh. Um. <laughs> they dodge the flame entirely. Yeah, they done. They're like, ah, ah, ah. All right. Your pilot <laughs> light wasn't lit, so you just spray a whole bunch of non flammable, non on fire. Nah. I don't know. I, I, would, I don't know where I was going with that. Yeah, let's look at that big double chair. That's correct. Yeah, that's, that's what it says. All right. Uh, they have to succeed on an agility test or be struck by the flames and take damage normally. If they take damage, they have to roll another agility test. Yeah, or catch on fire. Yeah, okay. Okay, so they did They did not take kind to you doing what you did, so they're going to come at you. And he's going to attack you. Oh no, it backfired. <laughs> he, he spontaneously catches on fire. <laughs> he walks into just one of the flames. In his mouth and he yeah, you're you're just like ah, and you're just like you just burnt toast that guy. <laughs> uh, next guy comes up. Oh, he lands a hit, and you can absorb that if you want. Next guy comes in. Uh -huh. Oh boy, I'm gonna try and dodge that first one. You can absorb it. You you will be fine to absorb it. Uh, it's like six penetration. It's yeah, uh I mean... pen. Let's see, pen six. So not... like twenty yeah, armor. Yeah. If you have twenty armor, it's okay. Yeah, he's All right. okay. Oh, that's I'll Hermagon. Hermagon. Let's see what the Hermagon pen is. There, they're pen three. Okay. Okay, next one's going to roll. Uh, oh, no. He, too, catches on fire. Because you're trying to, like, uh, compensate. Because the like, other guy hit you. Like, ah, scared me. Uh, he dies. So this guy catches on fire and explodes. Okay. This Termagant is going to take a shot at you. And, yes, he's firing the melee. He no care. <laughs> he's a dumb bug. What does he know? Right. Hopefully, I had to shoot his friend in the back of the head. <laughs> oh my god! He does know! Yeah. yeah. He shoots in the back of the head for 8. I'm gonna double it to. So that'll be 16. So he hits him pretty hard. Ah! And that's 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Five, six. Uh, this guy's gonna come out to Karnoff. I have a, uh, I have a talent called Battle Rage, which allows me to parry while I'm frenzied, so Go I can for take it. a parry. Nice. So, that would be my weapon skill? Yep. Minus 10. Yep. Do you gain any bonus to parry because you're frenzied? Uh, it's plus 10, so I guess it negates that. Zero. Yep, yeah, it'd be yeah. zero. Yeah, don't, don't short yourself, man. You want all the bonuses you can get. I yeah, see. Oh, good Ooh, thing, nice. too. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you, he comes in rah, trying to jump on you. You just block him with your big hefty thing. You just use it as a shield block him okay and it is now domingo go domingo 
Come in go. So I'm gonna try to move closer, around 12 meters. I think that's allowed since I could do half move and then use the squad bonus, right? Yep. All right, so I'm gonna move over here and fire at one of the warriors. Go for it. Actually, if you would be able to keep... Oh, never mind. No. Uh oh. Uh oh. What? Well, what armor is it? Eight or the bigger number down below? Body bigger is number down below is the armor. Oh, okay. Okay. So yes. I did them wrong last time. That's fine. So oh, we have mid? more armor? Yeah, they have eight. They have a lot more. Uh oh. <laughs> a lot more than I thought. So the the top arm the top one is the armor on them. The okay. bottom number is the armor on them plus their toughness bonus. Got it. Yeah. So I, but whatever, we'll just say the other ones are devolved de versions of the warriors. Well, with how often their weapons have been exploding, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, <they did. laughs> this is like from the Abbot Hive Tendril. Yeah, there clearly wasn't enough biomaterial to go around, so they just went for quantity <laughs> rather than quality with their units That's, this time around. Yep. So they're being the USSR then. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How'd hey, that plan missed. turn out for you, you dummy? You miss. Mm -hmm. doop, 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 miss. Yeah. I end turn then. Turn off. Uh, I would like to obliterate the shit out of this Termagant next to me. Uh, or is it, or is it Hormagant? Hormagant. Sorry, yeah. Uh, so, I have a talent, which is called Swift Attack, so I can attack twice. Ooh, so, let me do that. that. He's super dead. Plus 10, plus that, so it's plus 30 again, right? Oh, wait, no, that's just plus 20 because uh, we're outnumbering him and because I have a bonus from Frenzy. So, hit, I miss, oh. and then another Ooh. hit. What? Miss. Uh, boom. But, oh. but, I, <laughs> this, is, this feels like such bullshit. You're gonna spend a safe point to save yourself here? No, this feels like such bullshit because I have a talent which allows me to reroll one missed uh, melee attack per round. You should probably reroll that 96 then. Yeah, 96. I'm gonna have so much fun with that one. <laughs> so Jeez. I will do. Okay, there you go. I still miss. <laughs> wow. 77, oh 89, 96. You're going up in Hey, it's stuff. getting better, though. <laughs> it's getting better. <laughs> uh, what, what number did you re-roll? I re-rolled the first one, so I never rolled 9 to 6. So you have 89 is the first first one, and then... Or is it 77? 89, 89, 77 is the first, 89 is the second. Okay. Yeah. You guys kind of like... Trying to pick it up out of the ground, and then he sweet. Go ahead, do your damage. You swing it at this oh. poor creature. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is hit. Sorry. Yeah, uh, do your damage. Damage. Uh, you kill the poor creature. It goes through him. Wait, what? You didn't miss. He, he's gonna. It's gonna hit me. What? I'm next yeah, to it's... you. Yeah, I know what's happening here. Uh, not necessarily, you know, uh, let's see, and then your weapon, you, you use so much of your strength, you yeet that thing. Uh, let's see, where can I... Okay. God damn, servitors. Uh oh. Yeah, uh, and uh, it's over, well, it's over. It's over here now. Alright, can I mark it somehow? Yeah, I think I can. No, I already it's marked it. There. Oh, okay. It's a little circle. Oval yeah, you, you basically... Yeah, 20 meters. <laughs> Damn. You just chucked that thing. Quite an army got on you. I think in the future we need to hold more close combat training. Problem Focusing is Focusing on holding on to our weapons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Problem is. Because your guy is just so angry. He's like, oh, fuck this thing. <laughs> yeah, I cannot go pick it up because I'm in a frenzy. I'll have to go bare fisted into the next thing I see. It's like when you play baseball and you're hitting and you throw the bat. Wait, do I have a combat knife? Yeah, you should have a combat knife. Yeah. Yeah, your, your two-handed chainsword should have been extra. 
what's the stats on that? It's a 1d10 plus 2, pin 2. Pin 2, okay. Is it rend? Is it, does it have any traits? Nope. Okay. It, it, uh, the damage type is rending, but... Rending, okay. Back in high school, I wasn't allowed to play baseball because I would throw the bat every time I was hitting. Imagine what his character did, except with a giant ass sword. Yeah. <coughs> Cutting the poor creature in half. And he goes hurtling across the, the, the field. Okay, your turn's over, and Neil, go. All right, it's now my turn. So. Oh, yeah. Uh, I would like to take a half action to reload my gun because it's a half action, right? Depends on the gun. It's a. So, I think it's, it's a full turn. action because I there's didn't... a there's a rapid reload that allows you to reload half action. I think I did it for yell mug. I did it as a half action. Okay. So I'll, I'll keep I'll keep it consistent. So I'll reload, and then uh, I'm also going to. Now that these guys are a little bit closer, I'm going to throw a frag grenade between them, see if I can hit them both. And they're like, yeah, they're they're definitely in range. So, do my two-hit roll. Any bonus on that for the frag grenade? Um, that's... No bonus. You're aiming shot at it, so minus ten. Minus 10? Okay. Yeah, you're trying to get right between a particular spot. Yeah, true. Oh, boy. 47. You get? 47? Yeah, it goes wide. You just kind of toss it and just... Near, 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 near. Flows harmlessly behind him. <sighs> okay, that's my turn. It's just emotional damage. Dear <laughs> <laughs> murders. You spooked him. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, God, don't stop doing the, the boomy. <laughs> Give him a firecracker. Who's next? That's uh, Dancius. Me. I'm just looking up a couple of uh, ammo things real fast. I can duplicate a pay character sheet. <clears throat> I wish there was a way to quickly duplicate. Oh, I'll figure it out next time. You know, I can probably just do that. I'll just do a normal normal rounds still. Uh, I'm gonna do a full auto into uh this guy up here. Uh, uh, sorry, I forgot. Have you said that it's not a horde? Nope, not a horde. Okay, okay. Yeah, but I'm shooting at this guy up here. Uh, at full auto. Am I getting any bonuses? Oh, well, it's half range, so that's no plus 10. Are you which giving me... You which one are you shooting at? Uh, it's kind of... No, I won't say it's obscure by the wing. Okay, it's... then I'll do a free ten foot. Movie. No, no, you, no, you're good. You're not okay. obscured. I was, I'm, I'm trying to give you. It's a clear shot, so go ahead, give yourself another ten. Yeah, stop moving my character. All right. Nice. All right. So every degree of success is an additional bullet, so that's three damage. How much damage are you doing? Yeah. Uh, well, you did roll we'll, we'll see. <laughs> uh, is it is it more than thirty? Just answer that question. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So describe this. The. It will be you, yes. Yeah. Describe <laughs> what you do to this poor saw. Uh, I shoot him. I need to die. <laughs> I shoot him again. And he dies some more. Yep. <laughs> he tried to do his little backflip like his little friends did, but it just didn't work this time. Poor sod. Yeah, guess what I did? I, I shot him. He opened I his did. mouth and tried to eat the bullet. All right, Zeal, your turn. You're up. Flamethrower? 
flamethrower? Be a puffy carry guy. Oh, right. Uh, I can't use flamethrower. I have something engaged in melee with you. Okay. You do. Hammer gun. Yep. You did kill two with the flamethrower. You're like, ah! Oh, <laughs> ah, take that! Mm -hmm. I like it. I like Kill two after the... After firing the weapon, <laughs> they walked. They yeah. walked through the flames on the ground and lit themselves on fire. After they mm -hmm. artfully danced the first engagement, like, oh, you can't hit us, Jack Monkey. Ah, oh, we're on fire. <laughs> it's also like they just walked into the wall of fire. That's true. <laughs> They're pretty stupid so far. Okay, so <laughs> quick question about uh, point blank firing then. What, it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be three meters up to engaged in melee. Yep. You're in melee. Which means I wouldn't be able to use it. Why not? No, but you can. You, if you're using a bolt pistol, you're, you can. Uh, you're not supposed to be able to use a ranged weapon in melee. Yeah, we're going to say you can. All right. <laughs> then I'm going to shoot the dude in front of me with the shotgun. Is every movie I've ever seen them use the pistol, they've used it uh, almost exclusively in melee with sword and, and the bolter pistol. Yeah. In fact, Gun they put Fu. it on the face and blast. Yeah, it's like Gung Fu. Yeah, I, I wasn't going to fire my pistol, though. I was going to fire the shotgun. Oh, yeah, I'll allow it. It's a it shotgun, shoulder right? mounted, though, so there's that. Yeah, it's like a Predator thing. Blast, blast away. It's got a double tap. Now, now, if you were telling me it was the heavy bolter that Mr. Tactical yeah, Marine has on site, that ain't happening. You can smack him with it. You can do that. Uh-oh. Let's see. What what did you get on the first one? 74, and you got... What's the 30? Did you fate point roll it or something? Uh, no, no. It's, it's a full round attack. It has a double shot. All right. Twice. Uh, seventy-four. Uh, widely miss. Completely miss. Uh, let's see. And who's next to you, Dominguez? Uh oh. Actually, how close is he? Was how that close? a wild miss? It's not that. Wild. Nah, not Only not not, not that wild. Point yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Uh, and then go ahead and do your damage. Hey, I'm sorry. Nineteen. And this guy is super dead. So explain how you kill this guy with your, with your mighty oh, movement. headshot. Hey, and that's me. Boom. Okay, headshot. Herm Hermagons. All right. So I'm going to come up to you and melee you. Oh, boy. My character sheets are not. Ah, I can see the health bar for the warriors. Nice. Hey, I'm going to do a dodge check. Go for it. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no. That's not good. Oh! oh okay, yeah. so f 48 damage. Where does it hit? 49 minus 20, 70, 29 total. Holy fuck. So that's, uh, yeah, that's only one that's bad. 73, 73. 73. Would that be is you? my left. No, leg, no. Yeah. A right leg. Right leg. So, Holy shit. That's a lot of damage. It's a lot of damage. Is it <laughs> enough to uh, meet your wounds? Oh, yeah. I it. A my wounds are. Reduction? Yeah, so, after. Okay, so, alright, let me, let me explain. So, 41 plus 8 penetration. Oh, I have 20 armor, so... It gets... We have 12 because of the 8 penetration. Right. Mm -hmm. so, so, 41 minus 12, 12 is going to be... 29. Yeah, so that's still enough to max out my wounds, because I only have 22. Oh, that's critical Ooh, damage. That's critical damage. Yeah. Ooh. That's not good. That's I, cannot, not good. I cannot fix that in the field. Alright. So, can I roll... Can I do a fate point? Or am I already screwed? You can use a fate point to save yourself and, uh... 
But you can force that bug to re-roll again. His attack. I'll allow that. All right. I will uh, well, spend a fate point uh, to force re-roll. I would not help you much. Well, if he misses because of it. Oh wait, yeah, to hit. Oh yeah, to yeah. hit. Sure. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. So you're gonna use roll. a fate point to, to make him hit again. Yes. Okay. Down to one fate point. Right. The damage will be the same, but this will force him to, and he. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 All right, that's number one. Number two, it's coming up. He's gonna go for Moth. No, not the apothecary. Oh no. I mean, oh yes, because I'm gonna engage him. Yay! Yeah, with the with the little combat knife. It's it's the it's the thought that counts. I'm trying to. Oh no. Oh boy. And he's gonna hit for. Ooh! Oh, you can attempt to dodge. Oh, oh, he does. Oh, Holy you dodged, fuck! You dodged that. Nearly escaping death. Uh, Winters are no joke. <laughs> yeah, these ones are, yeah. Uh, let's see. Well, when they don't get obliterated in one shot, yes, they are poor. <laughs> yeah. That was more than one shot, let's be honest here. One, two, three. And then Termagant's gonna fire at you. Hey, just be glad they're not gene stealers. They're mm -hmm. even worse. Yeah. And he's going to do. Firing at you, Ansius. And he's not firing at you. He's missing completely, horribly. So, one, two, three, four. And then it's Karnov, he's coming for you. And then it's... Did it not roll it? It rolled it. Oh, it did. Okay, cool. Sorry. Okay. Right. Uh, he's gonna hit you for 18. Who's that one attack? Uh, Karnoth. Let's see. So that's a dodge right. check. Oh, oh wait. Or I can parry. parry. Check. Yeah, I can parry. No, you can't parry because you threw your chain sword. I yeah. have a combat knife. Oh, that's true. You do have a combat knife. So that's plus 10 to my parry. I, I do, Perry. Yeah, we block him. Let's see. Three, five, six, seven. And it is now Dominguez, go. So if I move closer to the warrior, I get to like a melee range, I will be able to like have a higher chance of attack. You have a yes. heavy, hey, you have a heavy bolter. Are you, are you trying to hit him with a melee weapon or are you trying to hit him with your bolter? Point well, bolter is uh, one to two meters. Hmm? So point blank bonus is one to two meters. Yeah, so you don't want to be in, in melee with yourself. That's a bolter pistol that uh, Moth had. But how much Shocker. would he need to move to get that point blank bonus with a heavy bolter? Uh, just a move action. I yeah, slice. Just yeah, it's not yeah, it's simple. Yeah, so right about right about here. Next, next them all. Okay. I like right here. Yeah, right there. All right. And I fire the heavy bolter against the closest oh, one. Yeah. Oh no. hell yeah. And that's it's a lot of bonuses. Plus right? thirty because of the the point blank, but minus ten because you're shooting in the melee. Okay, so 20 in total. Yep. 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 Now, also, he's, he's yeah. we're technically outnumbering this guy. Yeah, or so does that only him? count for in melee? No. Oh. Well, he's still succeeded. That only counts for in melee. All right. In melee. 20, I, got, I still got hit. Yeah, yeah. Still hit. Okay. Warrior damage. Okay. Uh, now, because it is a bolter, you can roll a 1d10 and try and place one of those threes and fours with a better roll. No. Oh, you're, you're saying that that one d ten, yeah, yeah, one d ten, and just to verify, you're saying that 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 big number at the bottom below the armor is their armor total, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. It. Yeah. He absorbed all of that. Well, hold on, Thomas. Twelve. Twenty-two. Right. Twenty-two with six pen. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, 22 is six pin. A. C, so. Okay. Be effectively, what, 20 damage? If he has eight armor? Uh, <laughs> well, he has, he has 18 armor, not eight. Ooh. So, does four. Four damage. It's, it's better than zero. <laughs> Wait, what's my damage? No, under? that's not right. If he has 18 armor with 6 pin, that means he has 12 armor left. Okay. And 12 minus 22 is 10 damage. Okay, so he's okay. Cool. Uh, Math. Right. Math. My brain, my brain hurts. How Eight. dare you? Yeah, How man. dare you? <laughs> Thank you Reading, for writing him arithmetic. The correct number. That, that would have been really bad. That would have not felt good. Like, man, I heard hitting him for, for peanuts. What's sad is, is he has better armor than I do. <laughs> Damn. I just had to roll crap on my toughness. Yeah. Hey, and here go. So, Karnoth. I'm still in melee with this dude. Uh, I've just had an easy up to this point, so we can crank it up a bit. Where is he? Uh, that's my. I'm gonna. I'm gonna hit him. That's a plus ten. I miss, so I do a swift by, attack. By how much? Eighty-four. With your knife? Yeah, that's my knife. Okay, your knife also falls on the ground. You try to hit him, bounces oh, off. Oh, okay. Because that's okay, eighty-four. Just... So this is this is using my knife. So I guess it should be discarded then. Uh, then. How can I do my unarmed uh, strike instead of that one? How do I calculate the, my unarmed strike? Or should, can I have a free action to pick up my knife? <laughs> yeah, free, action, free action, pick it up. All right, so I, I pick it up. <laughs> Just I miss, I, I fumble it, and I'm like, oh, whoops. <laughs> and I pick it up again, and I strike Who him. Who oiled the handles of our weapons? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Show me that servitor. <laughs> the GM did. Uh, all right, so that's two degrees. Okay, damage. All right, so that's my supposed damage. And okay. I guess I can only do one. Uh, five is, I mean, I can try and see if it's better, sure. Oh wait, no, it's not tearing, right? So I cannot re-roll. Re it's, it's like you drop your weapon or drop your knife and then you tell the warrior, one second, Hold up. and then you pick yeah. it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold up, one second, did. please. Stab. <laughs> mm -hmm. Stabbed him right. right in the eye. He's he's reeling. You stabbed him right in the top of the head. Oh my god. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess that, that's it. I guess I can't really do much else. Neil Tyron. Oh wait, stop, stop, stop. Wait, I have a challenge which is called Crushing Blow, which gives me plus two damage to my melee attacks. So that's. Oh be okay. Seven. Okay, so describe how you squish him after you stab him in the head. <laughs> Uh, after politely asking him to wait them for a second, I pick up my knife and I just uh, overhead just plunk it on top of through the top of his skull, and it's just like, and I just like point at him, and he just kind of falls backwards with my knife in him. How do you politely ask a question while raging? Exactly. We have, we have our Excuse me, will you hold still while I pick up my knife? Thank you, exactly. Shank. Exactly. <laughs> Hold this for me, damn it! <laughs> exactly. Uh, okay, so, my turn? Yep. Alright. So, I've got this guy... This guy's in melee range with me. So, can I try to point blank him with my bolt pistol? Yep. Alright. I will go ahead and do that. Oh, jeez. Modifier. Zero. It's plus 30. 30? Yeah, you're point blank. Okay. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, man. You really forgot to reload this weapon. You just shove it into this thing. Click. Click. You can try Fuck. using a fate point to reroll that attack. I would be if using my last fate point to do that. I'm not. I'm not keen on that. Are we, are we able to share? To have him are we able to share fate points? 
Mm, it's up no, to I don't think so. Um, you can. I allowed, oh, you can. Last, I allowed it last time, the last campaign I did. Yes, you can share fate points between each other. Sure, I'll burn one in. I got plenty. You're going to burn a fate point for me? All right. Yeah. If Don't you guys are in squad cohesion, so I'll say as long as you're in squad cohesion, you can share fate points. All right. We'll okay. do, that do another Since two hit cards. roll plus 30. Okay. Oh, that was to frag grenade. Oh, well. Uh, hang on. You can, you can that, yeah. That would be a nice story. <laughs> so do I Do I use that, or do I want to roll with the bolt pistol again? That's bolt. bolt pistol. Bolt pistol. Bolt pistol? All right. To be fair, it is the exact same roll. Is it? Is it? Yeah. Yeah. The yeah, math it's is the same. Oh, yeah, because it's a ballistic skill. Yeah. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah, yeah we'll, use the, we'll use that. Go ahead. Do, it really, do your damage for your pistol. All right. Here we go. 15. Uh, any other ten. modifiers? Well, it is tearing because it's a bolt weapon, so he can roll that 1d10 and try and replace that 2. No, it's not tearing. Yeah. It's explosive. No, 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 no. no uh, it's it's bolt, a bolt pistol. Bolt, bolt pistol pistols tearing. have uh, the tearing special trait. Oh, oh, I see that now. Yeah. So yeah. do I roll 1d10? Yep, you roll 1d10 and just replace uh, whichever is the lowest result you were Right. Doing. 6. So I'm going to replace the 2. Damage. How much? Yeah, so it's, it's 19, 19. And pen five. 19 with 5 pen. 19 with 5 pen. So, and he has. Let's see, math. He has 18. So one, 6. Oh, yep, 6 damage. It's not a whole lot. Yeah, it kind of like blasts him in the chest there. Um, let's see. Antius. Sweet. I am going to yes. run over here. E. Pick up this giant hulking blade and go, uh, Karnoth, your weapon. Hold on to it better this time and toss it over to Karnoth. I, I, my, I turn around Let's and see. I see if I have to do an agility check to catch it. <laughs> yeah, hold on. I'm looking up, see what other says. Yeah, I'm going to say agility check. I'm going to give you a plus uh, 10. Plus 10. plus 10. Yeah, let's give you a plus 10. Please. Yes! Nice! Ooh. You are fully uh, catch it. I nod. That was, appreciation. A... <laughs> that was a butt clutch. Here's a giant chain sword. Go ahead and please catch it. Now murder those warriors with it. Your hand I... nods while catching your weapon. <laughs> And uh, turn back around and facing the warriors now. All right. Uh, was that your full full action there, uh, Ancius? Yeah, basically. Okay. Uh, medic, go. Oh. <laughs> what to do here? <laughs> that was so cool. Ich liebe mein Flammenwerfer. That could, been, that could have gone totally wrong. <laughs> like, well, it's not 99. like the king sword would have been active when I threw it. You gotta press no, the for that shit to happen. Really, no, <laughs> but uh, one, uh, 100, it's possible you could have done something that stupid. Oh. <laughs> He's an ultramarine, he can't do that. Yeah, but at uh, 100, he just like, in the heat of the moment. <laughs> Wait, who's an ultramarine? I thought he was an iron snake. Yes. Iron snake. Uh, ultramarine successor chapter. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Zenoth, Sylvester, Zeal, go. Yeah. I'm debating whether I should disengage and get away from this thing or not. <laughs> I All would. Because right. if it hits, come fuck it's you good. up. It's a good <laughs> option to do. <laughs> yeah. But then we're going to lose our uh, benefits of two guys against well, one. Yeah, you here's what I'm thinking. Uh, who's, were, uh... who's more important? The medic or an assault marine? No, no, he's saying the assault marine Karnoth behind you. He's saying Karnoth takes his place, and the medic comes in behind you guys and heals you, or whatever. Yeah, but they're gonna go right after me, so it's, he's gonna go for the tactical marine. No, yeah, we'll see. What he's probably gonna go for whoever's closer, which is me. <laughs> Until well, unless he disengaged, then he'll go after the tactical yeah. marine, I'm or he just... might decide to go after that tech marine and double up. But I don't think they're that that's yeah. That would be pretty mean if what, they... Uh, what, 
What is their intelligence? What is their intelligence? I, I, I it, tell you. it really depends on if they're currently being controlled by a, uh, a leader bug at the moment yeah. or not. So their independent Which, intelligence is about 20, so... Which they technically are. Remember that we heard the screaming when we were going to this next second area? But that... Um, it's, it's a very limited range, otherwise they're... Yeah. Uh, just for all instincts of charge closest, kill closest. Yep. Yeah. They're basically but, in a frenzy all the time. Yeah. Otherwise, they have advanced tactics with a leadership, a leader bug. It's not really doing advanced tactics right now. They've mostly just been move and charge, close attack. You know, attack the closest. Yeah. yeah. Alright, well, I disengage it back up. And that's okay, let me... Well, the disengage action gives you a move, doesn't it? Uh, yeah. Well, then you cannot. Can you can shoot it with a no. anything? No. Disengage is full. Oh, it is a full action. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Gotcha. Uh, I'll attack opportunity there. No, no disengage doesn't give you get an attack I opportunity. Disengage. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was the that's Wait. the whole reason. I oh, okay, that. cool, excellent. Because that would have. But it takes my entire turn to do it, so I could do nothing else. Like any reload. Sweet. All right, uh, it's the bug's turn. So he is, this guy is going to swing at Domingos. Uh, he does technically have to take a couple steps towards him. Because he wasn't in melee. He moves to melee and he does, he engages in melee. Oh, then I should so, probably do a parry then. Yeah. You could dodge. do a parry or a dodge. Let's see. Perry relies see on right weapon skill. Brain. Yeah, let me. I'm referring to my uh, cheat. I, I see dodge. I'm trying to find Perry right now. Uh, there is no oh, it's Perry. a weapon, weapon skill. Perry is weapon raw skill. weapon. Dodge has bonuses. Yeah, dodge is a skill, but you can parry with a weapon skill, as long as you have a, a melee weapon, which you know, combat knife works. Right, so I'm trying. Well, is your agility higher or is your weapon skill higher? Agility. Did you you probably want to dodge. dodge. All right, and any modifier for no, dodge? No, just oh. regular. You're flat regular taking. Oh, okay. Ooh, you, got oh, shit. you are fully dodged. It had it hit you though, it would have been 37 damage. To um, your skull. To your skull. And then uh, let's see, Iron Hand, you are getting attacked. Yeah. Oh. He, he misses you. He is uh, not even in the ballpark. He's kind of like right next to you. See, that's one, two. Let's see. Three. And then this one's going to, this Hermagon's going to shoot at you. Hermagon. Gonna shoot at you, Karnoff. These pink guys are tough bastards. Uh, thank yeah, you. And, and there's another one on the way. Yeah. Okay, uh, are you gonna try to dodge that? I can't dodge as I am frenzied. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. He hits you for 13. I absorb uh, that. <laughs> yeah, he absorbed all of it. Uh, 31, which is body ass. Glances off you. So that's one, two, three, four. Uh, let's see. NC is going to be attacked here. <laughs> he thinks he's going to attack me. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> His weapon explodes and he just dies a horrible death. Oh As I God. said. <laughs> uh, so, <laughs> Turbo moves forward and now it's Dominguez's turn. <laughs> I love how you called that out. <laughs> he thinks he's going to. Boom. Take this guy out, Dom. Is it possible to bring the warrior to uh, prone to like lose yes. some stats? You there is a knock knockdown down. action. Right. Would that be more beneficial than shooting him? Probably. Uh, well, shooting, shooting in melee is a bad idea. Yeah. I don't even think he... Yeah, you should be it with everything else. He's in melee right now, currently, fighting for his life. Mm -hmm. And if I retreat, he, then he has an ability to... 
You yep, could take up. what, do what I did, take a full turn to just back up. Yep. Uh, yeah. It's just an opposed strength test, and you just have to get two degrees of success over his roll. Okay, I'm going to risk that then. For a warrior strength test? Yeah. Strength and no modifier. So uh, do I roll this guy's strength? Is that what we're doing? Yep. I'm, I'm going to just try to do a full retreat. Okay. Yeah, okay. So there's his strength check right there. All right, so the, do I roll strength or agility? Strength. strength. It's a strength. Strength. He rolled Sorry. a 59. Sorry, are you are you trying to knock him down or retreat? Yeah, retreating. Oh, you're retreating. No, retreating. Yeah. You don't oh, roll. Oh, oh, well, then that's just a disengage action. I yeah, thought you were yeah. knocking him down. Yeah, I thought that's what you were doing too. Yeah, I, I changed my mind. Oh, okay, okay, never mind then. Ignore what this. Just disengage. Move to right. where. I believe it's you get a full move when you escape. Full move. So not not a run or anything. Twelve. Like okay. That poor tech marine. That poor. Yeah, I know. Poor tech marine. I got some decision making to do here. Well, probably not, considering who goes next. Yeah, Carnot is I... next. Well, I can only <clears throat> deal with one of them, perhaps. Yeah, but he's not going to get, get swarmed by two warriors. Is the thing. Well, yeah, yeah, you're right. I... No, I'm making decision like what the bug does. Yeah, but it's not Bug's turn. It's Karnoff. No, I understand that. Yeah, I'm talking about, yeah, yeah. Good, yeah. Karnoff. I'm aware. I'm making decisions now as my, their turn comes up. Right. I, as I catch that chainsword in my hands, I rev it up and I just charge it towards this fucking menace of a beast. And I, and I, and I go ham. So I will roll to hit. Okay. That's gonna be plus ten. Uh and what's the they can parry, right? He will make a parry. Yeah, he'll he'll attempt to parry. Is it just a straight weapon there thing? I miss. I have a blade master, which means lets me re roll oh, my no. missed attack. Better re roll that, it's fucking ninety six. Weapon weapon skill for ballistics for parry, right? Uh, uh weapon ballistic skills is melee. For, yeah, weapon skills is melee, yes. Go ahead and roll your attack. Well, fuck. Oh. Uh, oh my god. He doesn't need to, so. We have fate points. <clears throat> yeah, you want to spend a fate, fate point, point? Or do you want to take your chance with me? It was another 95. Keep that in mind. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have so much fun with that. That sword's going away <laughs> again. Uh, more <laughs> than that. Unless we'll you see. do a fate point. Oh, no. Uh, question three is fate points. Uh, you do our fate, fate points re, uh, re, re, every uh, session? Every, every session, session you get okay. you get three. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna burn a fate point and I'm gonna reroll. Right. Uh, okay. Wait. Did I hit? Yeah, that was my. Uh huh. Hit modifier. Wait. I received plus one. Oh, never mind. Okay. So uh, you charged right that. for plus ten and you're frenzied for another okay. plus ten. So you should have a plus three uh, on that. He stops you. Oh, he he All right. Well, he carries it. I should say. Hey, he just knocks your big ass sword to the side. To the side. All right. Uh, because that is, well, I uh, my talent swift attack allows me to do two actions, but as a full action. So I guess I charged and attacked. So that was already my full action. So I cannot do Doesn't that. Doesn't charge? Well, when you, you charge, you get an attack with the charge. Yep. Yeah. So yep. that is a half action, I guess. The full action to, to charge the move, and then the full and action attack. to attack. That's two full actions. Okay. Neil Wait, so we have two full actions? But each no. space marine has two? Oh. No, no, no. I, yeah, right. just it just gave you full two full, essentially. The charge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the so running. I'm going to spend my full action to disengage and fall back. Yeah, that's probably wise. Probably wise. <laughs> Especially since that guy's not uh, near anybody anymore. It's less open season for the ranged people. Ooh, I, reco I recommend I'm to him into pace. Yeah. 
I recommend moving even, even further if you can. Uh, well, I moved 10 meters. Go. Oh. 10 meters <laughs> set. Disengage. 10 meters. It's, uh, yeah, it's your full move. It's disengage. Uh, oh, doesn't my... he have a free move? My full move uh, is 8. Well, that really would take up a close. reaction, and you don't want your reactions to dodge. <laughs> yeah, plus he's not in range. Yeah, I'll be moving closer, though. Oh, turn. it's uh, in range of the commander. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, I am done. You can't my daisy turn. chain. So, I will now do my... Oh, my gosh. Do my I'm going off the rails on a daisy chain. Bow, 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 wow. Bow, bow, wow. Sorry, okay. I had to do a little... Uh, I am going to switch to... Uh, an ammo type that gives me eight penetration. Uh, what ammo was it? Kraken rounds? Yeah. I'm switching to Kraken rounds, which gives me eight pin, uh, and I'm going to attack that guy that our tech marine was just tangling with. Oh, yeah, probably, probably so awesome. Oh, dude, yeah. you, oh, I can't wait to see Because the last war, you just eviscerated. Um, hopefully yeah. you do the same this time. So, um, because he's in the open, you've been giving us plus 10s, yeah? Yep, 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 uh, yep. Plus 10 because he's within half my range, which, uh, because I'm using a Kraken round, is now 200 meters. So he's definitely within half. And then full auto gives me a plus 20, so that's a plus 40. Mm -hmm. plus oh 40, my god. Damn. Well, I'm glad I got it, because that's only a, I only hit twice. Jeez. Well, that's two hits. Get him in. Oh. Oh. Uh, well, do you well, can you reroll once for each one? Yeah, yeah. You roll a d10 for each one to try and replace. And the pen is eight, not five, correct? Yes. Correct. On this, it's eight. Okay. Are you gonna re uh, use a fate point to reroll any of this? Ooh. Uh, well, uh -oh. if I can spend a fate point to reroll the second damage roll, sure. But the first damage roll, uh, got, uh, yes. 12 plus 5 for 17 with 8 pin. Yeah. And I can spend a fate to reroll the second damage? Yeah, whatever. Yeah. You can Sweet. I'll, I'll do that. Okay. That looked like it paid off. Uh, oh, yes. Right. So, uh, but because uh, I got a 10 on my first damage, I get it making another attack. Yep. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. go, 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 go. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> All right, just keep, just <laughs> give me the damage total when everything's done. I see a total da amount of damage. Well, Registry is just an extra attack. I don't think it's another full auto action. It's not, so it's, it's just full one other bullet. Just one more hit. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Well, that was pretty good. You hit him right in the right in the nuke in there. Okay, cool. So I've improved at least all the damage. All right. So totals on everything. Uh, twelve and five, seventeen. Uh, with eight pin because these are all separate damaging hits. So. Oh, oh, ten armor. Uh, so he takes seven damage for the first one then in total, hey. accounting for his armor. Hey. Uh, the second one is a twenty. Minus the 10, so 10 damage on the second one. Okay. And on the third one, that's 9 and 5, uh, 14, so 4 damage on the third one. Okay. Oh, wow, he's hurt. Bah, 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 bah. Jesus. And that was my turn. But not, uh... Yeah, uh, well, of course not. I mean, yeah. Once we learn what their actual armor is, uh, yeah. Hey, the best of steel. We'll just say the other ones are less evolved, and you're fighting the more evolved versions. Or the past ones were defective. Or let's a biomass to use on that. I mean, that is something the hive does do. So they'll make mutated versions, and they mutate according to what they're encountering. So that's why Tyranids are a nightmare to fight. Okay, Sylvester Steel, do your thing. Oh, because they're extremely adaptive then. Yeah. Yep. But it takes a while for them to regrow new stuff with that mutation. 
Yeah, like well, it's adaptive as Zerg in spacecraft are. It's are lame, but are. I'm reloading my bolt pistol and then firing one shot of the dude. Go for it. It's the same guy, this little guy down here. Oh, you got quick reload, huh? Oh, well, no, we've been doing half, half action. action reload. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. I've been, I've been, since I did for you, what I do for one, I do for all. So half action to reload. Oh, then all my reloads are free actions. Yay. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Reload is free action if you have it in this case. If you have the... Yeah, because normally reload's a full action, but... Uh, well, it actually depends on the weapon type. Like a flamer is two full, uh, reload, yeah, yeah. or two full actions to reload a flamer. Yep. But since Thomas is having all of these anyway, yep. Uh, so our normal reload on a bolter would be half. Yep. Okay. I have rapid reload, so it's just. So then it's a free action, unless uh, well, you have a heavy, right? I don't know what a heavies take. Ah, uh, that's a good question. Ooh. What yeah, were you doing? I was shooting this dude down here. Yeah, you just uh, miss wildly. Hey. No, heavy bolter is a uh, full action, so yeah, it's just a uh, free action for you as well. <laughs> All right, Karna, are, are you ready? Ready? I am. I was born ready. All right. Born ready. Oh, uh, he's striking you. Mm-hmm. I'm yeah, gonna parry that. Okay. So that's a, just a zero. minus. Oh yeah, is it zero? Okay, oh. you are. You you definitely dodge that. Okay. Uh, the other hermit god hair comes over here and is also attacking you. Oh boy. Yes, I, I can do two parries, by the way, per turn. From but do from two different damage sources, I believe. Or was it from one? Same. I don't remember. Uh, it's looking at me. Uh, where was it? Well, if you can't parry, you can at least try and dodge, right? Hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, I've been using the wrong bullets! Hellfire oh. rounds ignore natural armor. Oh, oh, oh. that tear him up. That's all they got is natural armor. Well, plus toughness. This toughness counts. Plus, as natural but that means... righteous fearing on damage rolls of nine and ten. Yeah, oh my that means they only that, that mean they'd only have ten armor versus you because their natural armor is eight. So that'd be ten just to ten toughness. Yeah, yeah I failed that one. And I, yes, I can, uh, I can parry two separate attacks. Okay, cool. Uh, Except for on this turn, which you can't. <laughs> 81, so you're just going to eat it. And he's going to be hitting you where? He's going to be hitting you... Oh, God. Ooh. That's the head, uh, right? Zero, zero one's head. Yeah, uh, can, can I... Uh, hey, can uh, I I'll, make this? I'll spend one of my fate points to let you reroll that parry. Yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> oh boy. You can also force the monster to reroll theirs too. He has a greater chance of hitting, because uh, he's you know he just needs a sixty-five. Okay. Although. I missed. Uh, 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 he's, uh, uh, he's still taking the thirty-six to the head. Uh, unless anyone else wants to spend fate point to make the monster reroll their attack. I can make. I can spend my fate point to make the monster re attack again. Yeah, re re-roll his attack. The he still hits you, but see, the see how much he hits you for. He hits you for uh one less damage. <laughs> one less damage. And in a nice. different place. In a and different in place. a different place. In a different place. He doesn't it hit your fucking head. Wait, fifty-one. That that's my body. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. That's very good. One d ten plus fifteen. Fifteen. That's your arm. 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 Right arm. Wait. You reverse the numbers on. Oh, 15. Oh, uh, 1d10 right so plus 20 plus 14. Is that their attack? My, my, my armor is 23. So Again? that's my minus armor eight. is tw 23. Eight penetration. So that's, oh yeah, that's minus 8. So 23. Yeah, so this is, uh, five. thick stuff. So 12. 15. Yeah, 12. So I gain 12 wounds, which puts me at... 19 wounds out of 20. <laughs> oh my oh, god. Jeez. Better me than you guys. So our Man, wounds... you're hanging in there by a fucking thread. So our total wounds is 20 for all of us? No. It varies based on toughness. Like yeah, mine are 22. Wait, wait, how do you, wait, how do you grow the max wounds then? Hold on. You should have... Your toughness bonus is off, though. You should have a lot more wounds than that. 
I have 22 total. I have 21 wounds. I think you roll a die and then add your toughness modifier. So he may have oh, yeah, that's on what his was. wounds. Oh, okay. So what's the die then? I don't think I did it. I just took the, the standard number, which is 20. I didn't actually roll for my total max wounds then. Right. And the uh, wounds. Gun. You roll 1d5 and add 18 to the result. And that's your wounds. There's no toughness anything. 1d plus 5 plus 18. Yeah, 1d5. Yeah, so if you got 18. 20, that means you rolled the 2. Then. Mm, 1d5 plus 18. What the hell does so, a d5 hey, hey, exactly. look like? Roll exactly. exactly. That. <laughs> Good. What does a d5 even look like? Or do you just roll a d10 and divide? It's a d10 divided by 2. Yeah. Well, uh, rounding what just happened? Up. What just happened? You, is it toughness saving? Uh, absolutely nothing changed. Nothing changed. Nothing changed. Yeah, we were just so seeing where his, uh, he calculated his health, and it was done correctly. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, so, oh, well, this guy comes in and he fails at attacking you. He just like mm -hmm. bounces off, bounces off your armor, gives you a little tickle. You're more concerned about the giant monster who fucking hates hit it. I have more <laughs> important matters to attend to. Fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so, and then the Termagant is going to take his shot at Antius here. He can try. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what did he get? Oh my god, he just kills himself. It just explodes. I already have a shield, but you have a shield of luck. I, I, my, uh, I think I need to change my specialty to a librarian. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh my heavens. Uh, yeah. Oh boy. He can try, try <laughs> fails. Love it. All right, Dom, Dom, Dominus Casteria, go. Uh, hey. Yeah, <clears throat> I'm going to use the Bolter with Fire Selector and gives the Warrior to my right, or the one that's not. Nice. Hmm? Do you have any special ammunition, by the way? No, I don't. You're a tactical marine. You should have one full uh, free special Let me, ammunition. Let me do something on... Which, by the way, Hellfire would be exactly that. Hey, how many do I have? Should I have a full clip? No, that's for just a regular bolt gun. You won't, wouldn't have it for a, a heavy bolter, but for the bolt gun that we start with the ammo selector, we have uh, one full clip of special ammunition that we get for free, up to 25 uh, requisition points. So you can have a full bolter clip of uh, Hellfire rounds. Yeah, then I'll have to make sure how many... Okay. Well, let's use the Hellfire round. Yeah. That, that's the one that negates uh, natural, natural armor. armor. Na yep. Natural armor. You're going to want yeah. that. <laughs> and... and and Righteous Fury on a 9 and 10 on damage rolls, so it's even better. Hold on. Oh, yeah. shit. This guy has the wrong one. wrong token. Give me a second. Yeah. And if the one didn't already have tearing, it would give it tearing. All right. Mm -hmm. Since I fired, uh, all right. that's plus 20. Uh, uh, for full four. auto is plus 30. He's in the open for another plus 10. Plus and 40. he's within half range for another plus 10. Plus so 50. 50. Yeah, plus 50. That uh, sounds about right. Was, I thought I was 20. Ooh, it's okay. not point blank, so it should be plus 40. Okay, plus, plus 40. 40. Plus 40. Anyway, you still hit. That's one degree success, I presume. Uh, yeah. yeah, which is two bullets, so two hit. Now, you're going to want to roll 1d10 for each of these to try and improve these results. Do 2d10. Be quicker. Yeah, That's sure. Hey, oh, look, shit. there's a righteous oh, wow. fury. <laughs> so, with Righteous Fury, you get to make that attack again with the same modifiers. Which is plus 50 now? Well, 40. it's just plus 40. Plus 40. Because full 40. auto is plus 20, half range plus 10, oh. and open for plus 10. So that's a hit. So that's another damage. Two, right? Cool. And then you can roll a D10 for that. Holy crap. Mm hmm. Can he, can he burn just his whole mag down? And you can burn your whole mag with that, yeah. Uh, Alright. But what is no, the mag capacity? no more Righteous Fury, so... Alright, that's what, like 26? 
18. So 23 for the first one with uh, heal. It only had five armor after penetration. And then the second so, one, you're replacing a one with a yeah. four. So Give 14 me. damage in total for the first one. Okay. Right. Uh, the second one is 10 damage. Okay. Right. Wait, but the it's like we're one. ignoring his armor, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, Hellfire is uh, hurting him. Not all him. of his armor. But majority of it. About eight, yeah. of, eight points of it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, and then the third one is uh, just 10 damage straight. Oh, wow. That thing is hurting. You fucked it up. Da -da 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 Ripping off yeah. arms and limbs. It's still standing and coming at you. And that's just two rounds, I fire? That was three. Three. three, three rounds, actually, okay. because it was full auto, uh, it's four rounds for the full auto. It's just two of them hit. Uh, and then that extra hit for the Righteous Furious. You actually shot five bullets. Okay. Three out of five hit? Well, two, yeah, three out of five. Okay. Nice. Yeah, three out of five hit, but you used five bullets. Okay, I'm just updating that right now. Karnoth, you're up. All right, I'm gonna attack the wounded warrior. I am at a disadvantage because I am standing. I am outnumbered. The wounded oh. warrior project. Thank my mm -hmm. So that's gonna be because I'm out number three to one. I presume that's like minus twenty or minus thirty. Yeah, it's oh. minus 20. 20, so... Plus 10 minus... Hold on. Oh, yeah. That's going to be just minus 20. Uh, wait, no. That's it's going minus to be minus 10. Because you're, you're frenzying. Yes, correct. For plus 10. Uh, minus 10. I hit. Yay! Can they parry, though? Uh, or do they not parry? Oh, they oh, Which one are you attacking, by the way? Um, the, the wounded warrior. That guy. He failed at pairing you? Nice. Ooh. Get fucked. Alright, do you damage? Oh, wait, no, sorry, that's hit. Uh, get damage. fucked. You should. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. You get to make another attack roll, which, look, you just did and you hit. That's another damage. I, and yep. another damage. There He's dead. Go. Oh, He's dead. man. Uh, what's the total damage? Uh, that's... So, if we account for its armor of uh, 12 with the penetration. Uh, that's 25 for the first one. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Uh, so go ahead and describe how you killed this uh, warrior bug. Uh, seeing how the bolter rounds were piercing its, uh, well, shell, I ascertained where its weak spots were, and I tried to strike exactly where they, like, landed, trying to penetrate those weak spots with my, uh, nice. well... A found sword, a chink and in I just his chiton. rip it apart. Yeah. Hey, does that mean that the second damage goes to the second guy? I don't know. I think it, it all goes to the same guy. Because well, I mean, your first, was your one first hit killed him. Oh. Well, all right. Him. He, uh, yeah. But that was my Righteous Fury. Yeah, and the yeah, Righteous Fury. Fury works in that. Hmm. He gets him right a second attack. Fury. Since he's in melee, it's not like he's oh, going to okay. go anywhere. That's true. I will, I'll grant it. So how much? Sweet. So before we calculate that, I notice you have type tearing, which means it's a tearing weapon, even though it should be yes. rending. That, so that means you get to roll another d10 and replace yes. the lowest no, no, value. I actually gave that weapon tearing. That was a special claymore. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, well, you can to be fair, chain swords have tearing, so... Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, my yeah. two hundred two hundred trading sword. Yeah, and six. So that's gonna Which be Which replaces the two. Twelve, so plus okay. Fourteen plus eighteen. Uh that's what, thirty two? Yeah, that's yeah. Plus, yeah, 32, yeah. For, and, and difference of four, yeah. So thirty two, so that's like another oh, fuck, I've got minus one. twelve. So oh, that's minus 20. fourteen. It's minus fourteen. Minus fourteen. And it's yeah, uh, minus 14. eighteen. So that's eighteen damage. Uh, yeah, it's hurting. Uh, lobbed and off, lobbed off an arm there. Uh, Did you get two attacks? Yeah, I can have a swift attack, but that's like if I... Well, actually, how does it work exactly? Let me see. If we get another attack, go for it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, for action, the character may take two melee attacks. Uh, it's two weapon loader, blah, blah, blah. 
as a full action, the character may make two melee attacks. So, can we make it so that I can spend my full action to attack twice, like two different yeah. targets? Yeah, All that's right. a full attack. That's a full action. Yep. Sure, go for it. So you Fine. get one more attack. Fine. Uh, get fucked. Plus, my, wait. Since I'm not, uh, am I? Yeah, I'm still outnumbered. But right, I, but yeah, it's but less. Less now. So it's only a minus ten, but you're plus ten yeah. for frenzy, so it's an even roll this time. Yeah, that's yep. an even roll this time. Oh yeah. And I miss. Oh. But I can re-roll it as a oh. talent. So uh, that's gonna be another roll. And I hit. Nice. <laughs> Do your damage. Ooh. Uh, and I remember to uh, roll that extra. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Eight. So, so that's eight, two with eight, ten, and that's fifteen. Four, no, that's six. six over this one, so that's uh, thirty-three. Thirty-three. Uh, minus, minus fourteen is uh, twelve. Yeah. Wait, no, for thirty-three 15? minus fourteen. Uh, twenty-three. Uh, nineteen. Yeah, nineteen. Minus, minus yeah, minus 19 health, because, yeah. Uh, the 33 yeah, you minus 12, minus 14 yeah. is, no. Yeah. Oh, uh, you can burn oh. a fate point and deal the last damage on it, or you can just, uh... By the way, that me. last oh, sorry. Was oh, wait, plus two, plus two damage because of my crashing blows. Oh! Plus because of my well, crashing blows. Super dead. He, uh, <laughs> describe how you killed this guy. Uh, seeing how, uh, like, like... After quickly dispatching with the other, uh, other warrior, I turn around and I just just started going ham at this in a spout of frenzy, just Ooh. like growling and just just keeping on swinging my sword, <sighs> and uh, until it's finally dead, just blindly. He's swinging. in pieces as if he were a cartoon character that walked into a chain link fence. Oh, oh man, that willpower roll. Yeah, against the uh, the rest of the pack here. Dang. I mean, the fact that they're rolling uh, against the thirty normally that should uh, tell you that there's no leader bugs nearby. Yeah. But, but your characters went. Enough. Your characters wouldn't know about that. It's <laughs> not <to> them. They <laughs> just know they killed two. Yes, they, stop meta gaming. It gives me solace to know that there's no horrifying monster along, uh, behind the horizon. Stop <laughs> meta gaming. Don't worry. Next That's session we'll die to a hive tyrant. Don't worry. We will fight a hive tyrant next session. We will all <laughs> die. Yep. Oh, uh, I can't wait. Thing is, you could probably force the player to notice if you're wrong, like a perception. Oh yeah, maybe. There's no uh, warrior bug in a her. Oh, actually, this hermagon disengages and then runs from you. You have attack opportunity if you wish. You just said he disengages, though. No, no, no. The other ones, the the massive horde. No, no you, you said guys... the words. This hormigant disengages. It's not even his turn, so he can't do that. Yeah, it's the well, second. No, it was turn. his turn. No, it was. Oh wait, no. no yeah. it's the second yeah, turn. It's and my then turn. It's gonna be my turn. I understand. Yeah. This, this is like out of turn. We'll so, save the uh, these guys, hormigants. All that's left is the this guy, the pinky. Yeah, and. The pinky. Uh, Remains. Because so do I uh, make an attack opportunity or do I not make an attack opportunity? You can, yeah, take it. No, but uh, the, uh, to the discretion of other players and like, should this be considered? I'm giving you an attack of opportunity, take it. Sh sure, uh, that's just my normal damage. Uh, that's not my normal weapon hit. Yep. Yep. Alright. You got uh, plus 10 because you're frenzy. Correct. Yeah, uh, it dies. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All that's left is that. All right. So now I'm going to open up on uh, this last pinky. So I'm going to roll for my bolter with fire selector. And then what's the modifier on that? Uh, full auto is plus 20. And he's in the open for plus Field. 10. And he's definitely within half range, so another plus 10, so plus 40. 40? Holy crap. All right. Oh, my God. A 99? You fucking you got a 99? So your weapon jams, doesn't it? Yes, your it does. Jams. It does. My bolter gets a stovepipe. Hold up. Let's see what I do. No, no. It's just a jam, so I can do a little more. A little more. I'm going to do a little more. All right. 
Yeah, your mag drops. It horribly jams. I get a squib load. Yeah, it, it the, the, the round half loads into the chamber <clears throat> and explodes. So, super jamming it. Brothers, I believe I'm going to need a new bolter after this. <laughs> no, I mean, the uh, uh, round that goes off halfway through the chamber, you don't. You just have to... You can easily... I do that. know that these bullets explode like grenades, right? Oh, they do, don't they? <laughs> I dismissively nod. I forgot they do. They're explosive, Yeah, the, they? the end of my barrel yeah. explodes and does a flower petal <laughs> shape. Your gun, your gun explodes. Yeah, your gun would explode then. All right. So do I take We're damage? We're really going to have to have a word with our attendants who take care of our weapons and gear. <laughs> yeah. Potentially beating him to death for negligence. <laughs> right? That's his gear up. <laughs> Looks okay. like the Tyranids swap his weapon with their own or something. Yeah. Well, they've been having the same problem where they explode and kill themselves. <laughs> it must be atmospheric. Uh, atmospheric atmospheric condition. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, he's so low health. I don't want to waste hellfire, but I'll do. A, I'll do it. I'll, I'll shoot hellfire into him again. Full, full auto. Yep. Uh, do you uh, just want to remove him? Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Yeah, just describe how you kill this guy. Cause I'm sure, <laughs> go ahead, roll your damage. Just I'm just curious. Oh, okay, sure. Uh, oh my god. But he's super dead. Um, uh -huh. oh. That's one, that's two. Yes, yes, two times, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the, the just... first, first two shots already killed him. So he had 14, 14 life. All right. So mm -hmm. as the as dust settles, blood everywhere. What do you guys do now? You, you told me to roll all my stuff, so I'm doing it. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's... he's, he's <laughs> oh, and, then, one. and then just... After oh you eviscerate this poor soul, describe <laughs> him. And in great detail, too. Oh, my yeah, God. I can roll oh my and God. see if I hit any, uh... Any extra nah. tens here. So, how many is that? It's, uh... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... D-tens. Good God. I imagine he just holds the trigger the down as he walks up to it and starts putting the barrel into his face as it's just a pile of goop. <laughs> okay, well, there's two more. Uh... There's one more 10. Yeah, but this is Hellfire, so they uh, trigger on nines. Oh, right. And there's two more hits. <laughs> mm -hmm. my oh, my God. Alright. What the fuck? Oh, you almost got another nut. <laughs> this is insanity. Oh my there's god. A 10. Keeps on going. The gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> uh, Alright, that's it. Uh, wait, that's no, that's not. Oh. Yeah, it's not. You still got oh, another no. 10. <laughs> Yeah, so I didn't see oh, right. if there were any nines in any of these damage rolls that I did, which if there are, that's more attacks. Oh my god, dude. And, uh, no. Yeah, I, he, I think you got... No. I, yeah, there are no more, so that is now all of them. Yeah. All right, so However, I would have elected not to have continued doing that and would have accepted my first four damage. Uh, <laughs> Okay. No, you kept you doing it. Come more, on, come on. There's I, no I, kill I mean, like yeah. overkill. Ammo's infinite. I want you to describe how you kill those last bastards. Oh, my special ammo. Special ammo's not infinite. Anyway, I, yeah, as they said before, I just, I'm going to do a slow walk and just unload into the back of him until he's dead. And then a little bit more until he's more dead. <laughs> and then a little Next bit more until he's brothers. even more dead. Just to make sure. Oh, I, I do a hard stomp onto his skull. Uh, as I step over and... Uh, Rejoin my battle brothers, I go, excellent fight, brothers. Now let's check this craft for tracks to see what happened to our Majos. Okay. Oh, right. no. I end my frenzy. I'm no longer frenzied. Medicaid, minus one. Yeah. I'm just sitting here trying to patch your wounds. I'll stand here, I guess. I'll just let you. Can I? There it is. Oh, never mind. Very good. Start approaching the wreckage. Yeah, so. How would that be? Uh, let me check. Should be four, but I'll check. Wait, out. but didn't you like to heal me to the max last last time? 
He's going uh, no, I healed eight wounds last time, if I remember right. Yeah. So who's doing what? All right, so I'm going, as a tech marine, I'm going to approach the uh, ship here, and I'm going to try and communicate with its machine spirit and figure out what's uh, going on. Plus 10? Uh, it, it broke. I, I also ten? joined... I, <laughs> I was also joined with the tech ma marine to help him out oh, as right. much as I can. Uh, I, I am trained in tech use. Oh, you are? Okay, so go ahead, uh, plus 10 as well. For tech use? Are you healed? Yes. Four wounds. Mm -hmm. That's considering I'm lightly damaged, by the way. Wow, you yep. did better yep. than the tech Four marine. Tech use. Okay, so that's going to be 15. Thank you. Okay. Okay, you go. You guys search the the records for evidence. You find that uh, they initially had four crew uh, died on impact. Their bodies are left where they died. Um, several servitors were either pulverized or shredded in the in the center hold of the shuttle. Started to come apart. Uh, various post craft modifications have been made to the shuttle's broadcast Vox system. Uh, hence, how you guys got the communication. He went down. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. It is doubtless the source of Mango's uh, last. Oh yeah, yeah. Da, da, da. and that's all you guys know. All right. Uh, so there was four crew. They're all dead. Does that mean the Magos is dead? No, he's not among them. It's four crew: a pilot and four generic crew members. It's not Magos. <clears throat> Uh, I would like to search for tracks to, uh, you know, determine if any passengers made it out. Minus 10. Minus 10. Oh, God. Am I doing a tracking roll or... Tracking. ...an awareness? Okay. Brother Neil, can you communicate with this, Mangles? Uh, nope. Communicate with the what? With Mangles. Uh, you're, trying to, you're trying to... Oh, he's a, he's a biologist. I'm not oh, a biologist. Are, uh, he has a biologist. He is a depth mechanic because he would be able to track him somehow. Oh, I thought Majors is a biologist, sorry. I'm I a tech you. marine, not a miracle worker. Uh, uh no, yeah. he's, he, no, he, he, doing his tech use as he's examining the shuttle, he's able to see the source of the transmission that gave you guys the initial uh, GPS coordinates of where the shuttle crashed and uh, the message initially from Majors that he's going to look and find shelter. Um, that they have crashed. And then, then Angus, you did a tracking test, right? Is that what that was? That role was? Ansius. There's no G. Ansi My word. Ansius. I would like to Ansius. assist uh, Ansius. You're, un you're, able, you're unable to find or locate any, any tracks immediately um, yourself. Search for tracks, I command. Now that I'm done tending right. wounds, can I also search for tracks? Yes. Everyone, minus 10 tracking? I, I'm i trained in tracking, apparently. <laughs> Everyone's trained in Yeah, we it's all are. Space oh, space God. He is zero. Oh, good, oh, yes. good lord. We well, I'm glad zero. one of us found it. <laughs> okay. I rolled the two. I find all the tracks. <laughs> mm. Oh, that was almost a nat one. You guys are, after scavenging around, you're able to find some, kind of some muddy footprints of uh, where possibly someone came. And in fact, they I'll came. Draw it. Or left. Left. Left the shuttle. It's a little draw thing. And they are human sized? It's a human footprint. Even better. Human sized and a human footprint. Yes. Mm -hmm. I would be concerned if, oh. uh... Yep, it goes off. Okay. You're, able to, you're mm. able to track it. Rattlings. Is there anything... Is there dead decor in the ship? Did we find anything in the ship? Yeah, let's search the ship. So. Sure, but be quick about it. So there actually is a skill called search. Go for it. All right. Modifier? May I assist? May I assist? Uh, a bonus to... 10? Uh, take my plus 10 yep. or minus 10? I didn't catch that. Plus 10. Okay. Oh, Jesus. 
Yeah, you're not uh, trained in it. I'm not trained in search, no. Yeah, you kind of stumble around, you find a box of, or not a box, you find a bunch of scroll souls crushed. And that's about it. That's all you find. Dead servitors. I also join a search. I also join a search as well. For it. Oh. Okay, that's plus 10, right? Let's see. What'd you get? 92? Oh, you think you found the data core. In fact, you're going <laughs> through the service calls. You find something. Oh, this must be it. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, no. You, oh, no. Also ver you also verify his little finding, too. Oh, this must be it. Uh, we have to find the, the data core. Now, can the, I right, do... And then... Nick Marine, please I, verify that that is the data core we're after. I'm going to roll right. tech Andrew, use. Into following these tracks, though. All right. Right. Modifier for tech use. Uh, it's going to be a plus 20. Okay. Because it's obviously not a data core. Right. Damn grenade. Brothers, oh, this not. is most certainly not a data core. Yeah, it's just, it's someone's lunch that... <laughs> so bad. Oh, they did roll real low. This is it's a lunch like box. Use organic matter for a data core. No, no, well, no. It's, it's a, inside it's a, a box. Cylinder. It's a, it's, it looks like a cylinder type thing. You open it up, it's it's someone's lunch. Yeah, I hit like a button and open it up, and oh, there's yeah, a sandwich. Lunchbox. Yeah, it looks like a it looks like a data core. But like uh, they're just like, oh yeah, it looks approximately like that. Cool cylinder object. Here you go. Open it. Uh, tomato juice falls out, basically. <laughs> I discontinued those form factors because of all the confusion with food and data cores constantly <laughs> being mixed up. It seems that this Magos is working with ancient technology. <laughs> and then I murmured first the radio tower and now this. Right. <laughs> I am so disappointed in my team for mistaking that as a data core. Okay, I was very disappointed in my team for uh, mistaking a radio tower for a spaceship. <laughs> I was very disappointed in my team for planting a grenade in their face. I, I am <laughs> not disappointed in my team. <laughs> Alright, so you're tracking their boss? Yep. Okay. Small these tracks. Let's go and get ourselves an actual Magos, and hopefully we identify them as an actual Magos when we find them. Okay, Lord. you guys are following, as you're following the track, Smoth, you come upon uh, some combat servitors on the ground. Two naval, are they two dead? dead two, uh, they're dead, they're destroyed, and there's two naval uh, crew members nearby as well. Looks like there is possibly a fight in this area. But they also dead. You don't see anything else other than the dead crew members, the dead servitors. Well, you just said the servitors were dead. You didn't say the crewmen were dead. They're dead. Everything's cool. dead. All right, can we make a tracking use to see if anybody scurried off? Yeah. Go for it. Any modifiers? B minus 10. And so, as you, yeah, answers you kind of, kind of meander off. You're like you're following something. You think it's pretty, pretty spot on what you need. Uh, the apothecary <clears throat> kind of corrects you, but everyone oh, else God. is following. Uh, Ancius here. And you're following your blood trips out here. Oh my God. Oh. Yep. Where are you going? I don't know. I thought you tell it was us. this way, but I think Those I've are lost animal the tracks. You're at 93, so you're very confident. Your character's very confident it's in this direction. <laughs> there. Very I'm confident. very confident it's in this direction. And now that everyone else backs you up on this. Yeah, it seems to be. Oh, you, are boy. The, you are the team captain. It's clearly this way. You're just following a little bit of blood trail in the distance there. Oh, boy. I don't think there's blood anything I can do to try and correct them, is there? <laughs> you can can do you roll for, like, persuasion or something? <laughs> yeah, so, do, uh, do a charm roll. Do a charm since, roll. since I'm also a tactical, should I also check? Mm. Like, do a command? No, we, no you also failed. <laughs> you also failed. You you believe everything your commander tells you. So you be, this is... Eh? This, yeah, so you're coming. You're right. Charm roll. Aye, aye. This is but not going to go well. Apothecary, sure, try sure. a charm roll. Yeah, because he definitely knows that they're going the wrong way. 
more than likely. And, I'd say and, he should get some kind of a bonus. You know, we're not. Uh, we're not uh no. Uh, <clears throat> your degree in trust the apothecary is probably higher than anyone else here. He's done save people on the battlefield. I'll give you a plus twenty. Try to convince them. Um. You can even yeah. add, you can even do a med test on the blood that they're following too if you wanted to. <laughs> oh, okay, good. Yeah, I'll do that instead. And that'll give you another plus ten. What was your fellowship? Oh, no, you just you're not trying another to plus ten. So that's another two plus, plus ten. 10 if, so twenty. If, no, no. If you succeed the medical test on the blood, discover what wow. it is, you get another plus ten to your fellowship to. Your charm him. test. That's correct. Well, succeeded on the medical test. Hey. Cool. So that's right. a plus thirty charm test, which should bring you back up to about a normal roll again. Okay, right, so <laughs> you, with, with certainty, can tell them that the blood trail that they are following is indeed a um, warrior, another warrior bug. Well, it's not even the right color. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Charm the shit out of us, your feminine wiles, because you're a female <laughs> character. Well, no, I mean, oh, he'd, be captain. He, he'd be talking to the captain directly. Hey, that really isn't the right way. You're following death. Do not go that way. <laughs> ah, I see. Well, I'm glad you analyzed that blood. Otherwise, we would never have known. <laughs> no, you just, saw, you just saw a blood trail. And like, okay, this must be where you went. Because there is some footprints in that area, sort of, your character thinks. It, it's probably dark. I pull out the uh, the flamer and I put the pile of light close to it. It's not even red blood, is it? No. <laughs> no. It's like green and purple. Do right. we roll our tracking? I mean, I succeeded the tracking yeah. roll. Yeah. No, I mean, like, but we're like tracking again since we're like, oh, this was like the wrong track. You know, I mean, you can uh, kind of help them track. So, you know. Moth, Moth already was... Moth already knows, so we shouldn't need to roll again. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, okay. I succeeded the tracking roll originally. All right. Everybody else failed. Yeah. So there was. Oh, right, well, I see you. Uh, you've found the other trail. Yes. The actual trail. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Well, then uh, you take points since uh, you seem to be able to see it, and none of us can. All right. Then. Proceed of caution, brothers. Okay. Let's find do. this majus. Okay. So you doing? You did your tracking there, Moth. Uh, do I need to do another roll? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you guys go uh, about. I'd say about ten meters in one direction, and then the trail ends. Still doing the minus ten. Huh. Uh, yeah, minus ten. Okay, you guys lost the trail. You have no clue where this is. Where this is. However, you do find there is uh, actual human blood uh, that leads off into. Oh, so we found trail. the trail. You found a blood. You found blood trippings in a direction, then it ends. Can we like, be robo tracking all of us? Yeah. All right. Minus ten. Oh shit. Yeah, let's see, what was yours? Did everybody dump intelligence? Damn! Oh my, my intelligence God. is a 41! Yeah, my intelligence is 47. But it's a minus 10. You definitely you lost the trail. <laughs> you guys definitely lost the trail. You have no clue. Ooh. Can I, can I awareness, um, some kind of structure that would have, that one would, could take shelter in? Within it. the direction that this trail was heading in. Is there any modifiers to this? Plus 10? Sweet. With my extra plus 20 for being a space marine in power armor, three degrees of success. Yeah, you're analyzing, like, where this guy could possibly be. You lost the trail, you see in the distance. <laughs> no visible structures of any kind. A lot of valleys, a lot of... To you, it just seems like barren wasteland uh you do notice the servo skulls combat servo skulls the bodies and that's all you see uh your character would be aware servo skulls do have uh 
they do contain records. They record things. See if these servo skulls has anything useful in it. I can tech also marine? roll. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Okay, you said tech marine. Yeah. Tech use modifier. Okay. Uh, let's give you minus twenty. Minus twenty. Okay. Oh god. <sighs> okay. Uh, Not again. The first one is obviously unusable. Uh, there are. Let's see. Yeah. There's a couple more you can look at. There's about a total of three combat server skulls in the area. Minus 20 again. Oh, yeah. Oh. And let's try one more. Yep. Ooh, just Yay. barely. We, uh, you're able to, this one has just survived just barely enough. Um, you can recover and re download the last few images the server skull took from his visual cortex into a day slate aspect display and display what it saw. All right, so do it's do like that? a, yes, I like do a hologram. that. It's like Star Wars, like a hologram. Okay. Help me, OG uh, Wan Kenobi, you're my only hope. Essentially, this shows a grainy green tinted picture of Hermagon's flashing flying claws, a brief, desperate firefight in the area, uh, viewed from the ground level, showing the savage deaths of all both the, both the uh, the naval airmen. Uh, coming quickly into view, looming figure, uh, quarter black and white, uh, cowling robe, fights back in deadly combat with lightning quick, lightning quickness against the monsters, flailing and striking, whirling mechanical limbs and unleashing searing blasts of energy at them. Uh, the figure is victorious, but dark stains clearly, but a dark stain clearly and rapidly spreads across his crowd as it staggers off the fallen servitor's field of vision, but surely then breaks up afterwards in a static before falling to darkness. All right. So you saw so... the fight. You saw the fight. You saw the... <clears throat> so is there any way we can make sense of what that black and white figure was? That was Uro. It's what? Mm -hmm. That was who we're looking for, Magos. Magos. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right direction. And I'm assuming, is that the same direction as the uh, Trail of Blood we saw? Say again? That's the same direction on the Trail of Blood? You have a general direction? No, of, is uh, that going, is that, was that figure going in the same direction as the Trail of Blood we saw? Oh, the previous or one? Earlier. No, 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 not no, the not, not the previous one, the one we found over here. The human yeah, boy. The yeah, the new one, yeah, gives you general direction. Uh, you're able to deduce from the video and kind of like the direction. That's where the direction he went in. All right, so let's head that way. Excellent. Excellent. You want to start a good stopping point? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah. that's good. Yeah. So, XP. Uh, so, since you fought three warriors, I'm going to give we you... Fought, uh, we warriors. fought four, we actually. Four. So I'm going I'm to give actually, you... did uh, we kill five? Because you brought in, like, an additional three. So, I, four in that one, and then uh, no, there's four in that one in the previous engagement. So, five in total. Wasn't it four? I, we only I thought warriors. it was three. I thought it was, it was, it was one of the original and then another three. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, five. Oh. Five. A lesser warrior in the ver first one he eviscerated, um, mm -hmm. and then the the other four were uh, juiced up. No, no, the, the first the first warrior we killed in this was also a less juiced up, I think. No, no, these were really juiced. These were they had 18 armor. That other one only had eight. Yeah, yeah, we killed three of them, which were juiced up. But like the first one we obliterated was a normal one, I think, like like the the devolved one. No, no, no. Nope. Four. no. The devolved one had eight. All the right. The bigger ones had 18. Yeah, 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 yeah. They were normal warriors. The first one was the... the I just yeah, got devolved. promoted warrior. Right, so I'll give you uh, 200 for the devolved one, 400 uh, for each of those warriors you guys killed. Just tell us the total. Let's see, two... That's, two four, that's 16, 1800. 1800. That was, quite, that, was, that was quite a fight. So 1800 for the whole thing. 
So that's what was it? Six hundred from last time. Two thousand four hundred. Yeah, four hundred in total. Plus yeah, any just, other XP that you haven't spent yet. Yeah, I'm just saying total. After yeah, but we're not. You, we can't spend our XP until we're done with this yep. mission. All right. Sweet. And is that going to wrap it up then, Mr. GM? Boko? Boko just... <laughs> he just left. I, 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 no, I, I dropped out. Sorry, I dropped out. It dropped out. All right. <clears throat> uh, so say again? Sorry. Yeah, are we, are we done? Se session done? Oh, yeah. Session's over. Uh, All right. Sweet. Then, Sweet. in that case, I will see you all next week, and this will be up on YouTube shortly. Hell yeah. Sorry. Right. Juice. Hey, GM, are we ready to end the session? GM leaves. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Uh, so what did you guys think of that one, that, that encounter? I was trying to... Yes. It was, it was tough. Fate. If If it hadn't been for our fate points, I think yeah. a couple of us would be screwed. Dan and yeah. I at least. Yeah. So, yeah, that was... Yeah. Um, Go ahead. The Warriors were a lot more tougher than I thought. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So you're supposed yeah, to be yeah. a menace to Space Marines, yes. Yeah, that's Space One, so I, you know, I was like, oh, I can mutate these guys. So I've been <laughs> tweaking them. <laughs> Say tweaking in a menacing way. <laughs> <laughs> Just tweaked them a little bit, you know, just to make things interesting. Tweaked them or read their stats correctly? No, no, I got their <laughs> stats. No, 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 no. That's fine. That's acceptable because that was a random encounter. Do you really want to spend an hour in a random encounter? No, that was, it's was enough to get, get your juices flowing. But oh, that no, oh, okay. I actually did modify because I, was, I did modify their weapon stats. I added some new additional weaponry. I was like, oh, this would be fun. Oh, so they hit harder? Okay. They uh, hit a lot harder. Yeah, we noticed. <laughs> yeah, I mean, oh. I, don't, I don't know if you noticed, Yo Mug, what I've noticed, that you guys just raffle stomp through everything. So I'm not building them to be anti- I can easily make them anti you guys. I was I was upping well, it to where again, it- Again, first mission. Oh, yeah. First mission. <laughs> it has to be difficult, though. I want you to guys feel it. You guys oh, oh, it has them. to be difficult. Oh, okay. Has mm -hmm. to be difficult. I you mean, this is the training. Death Watch. Do they do they call you guys in to take on pussy whipping missions? No, they no. call you in the, the hardest bullshit ever. <laughs> yeah. for suicide. Imperial Guard. And normal Space Marines. And no, if that was Imperial, if you guys were Imperial Guards, normal humans, you'd be dead. You'd be straight up dead. You'd be dead like be... twenty times over by now. <laughs> yeah, there are other characters that are in the game. The the mercenary group. Uh, yeah, they're just. Is he coming next time or no? I don't think so. Okay. So I'm going to say they just got lost. Yeah. Or I can introduce them still because they are an asset. I a they delightful. are a secondary objective. They are a delightful asset. So I will I will make something happen. All right. Sweet. I, I, I've been trying to delay it in, in the case Robopine came and I want to mess with this character because that's us. That was supposed to be his introduction, but... Oh, damn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, in the ship? No, not here. I mean, it would have been actually sooner. It would have been uh, on the drop the point. Ah, yeah. The drop point. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because... Well, how fun would that be to him watch you guys play? <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta bring him, bring him in immediately. And he would have died immediately. Yeah. True. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. All right, Stay gents. Back. Stay behind everybody. Don't stay yeah, up yeah. front. You will get shot and you will die. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think I, I will ha I have to bail, though. Thank you for the okay. Take it easy. good right. session. Likewise. Yeah, see ya. Catch you all later. Yeah. I think see next mi next mission, I'm going to go crazy with some of the stats and weaponry so we can... <laughs> I really do. I'll get the rights of battle, get some ideas, get some cool stuff going. Sweet. Yeah. Can't wait. It'll be fun. Yeah, I don't know if I want to continue with 
So if we can go back to my original plan, which was mission to mission basis, not a uh, overarching story, I'll just mix up the monsters. Well, we want we want some overarching story, but not not a whole lot. There's like I think Death Watch, Death Watch is not yeah. But if you read the Lord Death Watch, their main thing is not to go on can great campaigns. They go in, they do a mission, they bounce, they go somewhere else if they're needed. So the Sun actual Tzu said. Camp let your great object be victory, not lengthy campaigns. Right, so, because Death Watch, they're not meant to fight the X. You would not be designed to fight the entire campaign with the uh, the swarm, other than key key battles that you need to go in there, and, like, you're like a, a fine Razor Blade. Yeah. Whereas a Imperial Guard would fight the main battles, the Navy would fight the main battles, or like they'll the... handle the... We're like the equivalent of the U.S. Navy SEALs. We go in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. If, if needed, yeah. So you may be pulled here, do this mission, and then be pulled to the other side of the galaxy, doing another mission. Right. I mean, bro. it's just how whatever. Do they, how do they travel so fast? To the warp. Oh. The warp. The Emperor actually is a is a, he's a he's on the Golden Throne. He is a beacon for all of the Imperium, and they can they basically travel through hell to then go faster than the speed of light. In fact, that's if you do fail on like navigation through the warp, you can be attacked by demons on your ship. Oh. Now, granted, it still takes like months and sometimes years to get to where you're going, even when going through the warp. Yep. And if you, yeah, 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 if you fuck up navigation, you can just be lost forever. Just gone. I would imagine <laughs> that a lot of the story, though, is going to be more of an emergent type narrative between the space marines because as they're going on missions like they're going to be sharing stories from their chapter and like getting buddy buddy with that, each other that would be where you guys role play what you guys are doing right, now right 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 the death watch's main thing is combat i don't know if you noticed that it's always been combat 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 a little yep. bit army combat combat that, combat that's a space marine's main thing too yeah. what a coincidence I, I know it's like the game was designed around just blowing shit up who doesn't so, like blowing stuff up? So, <laughs> my, my job is GM, yeah. So my job as a GM, DM is a little bit easier because all I have to do is make interesting mobs for you guys to, to tackle. I think that warrior proved pretty fun. Oh yeah, challenging, challenging enough to where we go. Oh shit! Oh, this is serious. <laughs> I'm going to die here. Let's work as a team. So that was good. Yeah. But yeah, it's also re reading the stats correctly, yell mug, that, that, that definitely did help. But didn't it feel good to blow that motherfucker away? <laughs> it felt way Cathartic. too easy. But did it not feel good? Eh. It felt out of lore that just immediately eviscerate him a little bit. You're well, I guess good. that depends on the book you're reading, because depending on the lore book, it's, oh yeah, they'll just eviscerate it immediately. Or, now there's supposed to be a challenge. Right, so I mean, and again, you're gonna with with the Tyrans, you're gonna be fighting a wide variety of monsters and builds, whatever that their uh, tendril makes. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. I've been throwing junk at you. Uh, I'm sure you noticed. And like, oh man, it's all easy, and then oh crap, something <laughs> hard. See, uh, like a bad GM though, Tesseract. I've, I've actually was watching videos. Let's throw all the hard crap at you all at once. Big yeah. old monsters, and then they'll change the storyline to uh, that one GM we went with. I can't remember his name. That's all right. We don't need to. We don't need to mention his name. It's fine. Oh, you mad at him now? No, I'm not mad at him. But it's like, I oh, yeah. don't. I don't want to be like, oh man, this GM was so bad and talking shit, and then it's on the YouTube. No, no, video. no. I'll tell him. I'll tell him to his face, like, dude, that sucks. I mean, that really sucks. Don't uh, do that whatever. again. Yeah. Water under the bridge. No, I know. I don't care. I just use it as a, a how can I be better? I've because I sure I can yeah. be really bad. Everyone's bad. I I do things that are bad. Not reading the stats, bad. Not tracking turns, bad. Uh, I should be as knowledgeable or more knowledgeable than Yelmug. <laughs> that should, that I understand Yelmug, I, I, but that that should be my standard, right? You would not agree, right? It you should. Would agree, right? Yes, it should. Right. That's that's the standard. All right. Y'all take it easy. Sweet. See you all next week. See ya. Yeah. See ya.